Hi Miku! This is Yuria. Being true to who you are makes all your dreams possible. Hello everybody, welcome, welcome. <clears throat> now let me change. Uh my <laughs> My mouth is not working. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me Okay, how about now? No? No? Yes? Yes, it is working. Okay, okay. I think. I think it's working. It seems to be <laughs> correctly responding to what I am saying. <laughs> Don't worry, I am not truly dead. It was just a joke, okay? As you can see, I'm here. It's not pre-recorded. We already talked about this. <laughs> yeah, I know, it sounds absurd. <laughs> Hello, Bo. How is everybody doing? Your AI. No, no, no. Never ever. I'm tired. Honestly, me too. I slept kind of bad. Mostly because I kept getting woken up by a certain individual by the name of Corin. And... I don't know, I, I... I was awake at like... Well, I was awake pretty early. And I just decided, you know what, I'll just stay up. And, or like, I, I'll get up and I will go to bed early. Tonight. You know, otherwise... If I'm just gonna fall asleep again... I will wake up way too late. Two years of Yuria Bamboo. Exactly two years. Thank you so much. Hello, hello. I'm silent today? Oh, wait, what? Oh, yeah, my volume... Wait, how about now? Is it better? No, it still seems to be lower. What the fuck? Yeah, I'm catching it now. That's weird. Let me go over my settings. Because I noticed things were kind of... Uh, that's also, I think, where why the 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 mouth thing is not working correctly. Okay, is this better? No. It's weird because I never changed any of my settings. It's really over. Uh, let me double check, cause could have just been could just be a Windows thing, I guess. Oh wait, my volume is really low. Okay, how's it now? Is it better or is it like or is it like peaking? Is better? Okay, okay. I think I know what this is. So, for the... For the... For the meet and greet... I had to use, like, Microsoft uh, Teams or whatever. And it wouldn't surprise me if that... Adjusted my volume in any way. Because it do be some weird window stuff. And I noticed I went to my window settings and my volume was really low. It's also, it's currently right now still, at, it's at 50%, but like, that's loud enough, alright? <laughs> Usually you're louder, I can go louder. I'm just, it's because I don't hear it myself, I don't want to fuck up with the, I don't want to fuck with the settings too much. Because for me, the previous sound is like the same. How's, how's this? How's this? Is this good? Or is this too loud now? I'm still not... It should be a little bit better, maybe? I'm still not in, like, the red-ish area. So technically, it should be good. It's good volume now. Teams tends to fuck with things. Okay, yeah, I'm not surprised. Microsoft Teams, I know! 
that's that's just the software that they use to so that's just what i had to deal with it seems better okay that's good i can um i can make it even louder now it's at 65. okay i'm just kind of curious how it is at 100. i will slowly go up okay it's like it's probably gonna be like super loud at 100. holy shit! how sensitive is this thing Test, 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 test. Okay. Actually, now it's at... Oh, that's very loud. Th this is 100. This is 100. And I'm like not... I'm trying to speak a little... <laughs> less loud. <laughs> this, is, this is 100. This is 100%. It, it, it goes into the red, as in it's too loud. Way too dang. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> How's this? Also, this is, I'll, I'll go back to where we were about... Here we go. You're uh, blowing my ears out. I'm so sorry. Start screaming. Oh my god. I'm gonna... Everyone who, who just got here, every new viewer is gonna be... Okay, I'm leaving again. This this sucks. I'm gonna... My ears are just gonna bleed. Okay. I'll leave it at this then. I'll leave it at this. This should be... This should, this should be loud enough, right? Thanks for letting me know, though. It's never. It, I. I'm very much assuming it was Teams that fucked something up. Windows or whatever. Next Zuria burp is gonna destroy everybody's speakers. I am sure there is a large amount of people that would not mind that. Honestly. <laughs> But I... That's 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 not something that I actually want to do. <laughs> uh, we are so back. Hell yeah. Okay, I'm gonna need to change some settings. Because otherwise it's currently... It'll be the same as... Uh, during... The celebration stream one yeah okay we're good <clears throat> anyway yeah um i didn't want to i didn't want to fall back asleep even though i probably could it's like ah oh, well if i do fall asleep now i will just mess up my sleep schedule again so it'll just be a day where i'm a little bit more tired than usual, but that's fine. I'll go to bed early. Quotation mark early. Or at least... Earlier. <laughs> hi, hi, Gingers. Welcome. So, uh... I was originally gonna stream Sunday, but... Uh, I stayed at the... Uh, meet and greet, like a... I was like the last guest, right? So... Um, they're all just like, well, you can just stay until, until, like, we close up. So that's what I did. <laughs> and if anyone is now here from, uh, from, like, seeing me there for the first time, hello. It was great meeting you. <laughs> uh, yeah, it was a lot of fun. But it does take a lot of, I don't know how, it's, it's kind of, it's probably dumb, but you know, like the, the introvert social energy. It's very, very different uh, talking to chat than it is to, you know, actual people. <laughs> or at least, I know you guys are actual people, but face to face, right? <clears throat> so uh, that's got to be moved. And yesterday, uh, our... Yesterday was uh, kind of, uh, you know, well, I wouldn't say a chill day, but it was a day where, you know, just like groceries and stuff. <laughs> she, do you mean it? Uh, are we real? Yes. Yeah, reading text versus making a phone call. There's so many people who prefer like texting nowadays, right? It's so much more exhausting to make a phone call compared to texting. And for some things, you do want to make a phone call. Because it feels more direct and you will get an immediate answer instead of having to wait. So I get that too. But yeah. It's very much different to respond to chat. <laughs> uh, 
it really, really have to makes me practice my how to make a conversation skill with people you don't really know. <laughs> you guys are real, right? Okay, I'm actually lowering it like a little bit. No, it's mostly okay. Okay, a little, little bit, little bit. Okay. So, uh, how's the weather? Yeah, you go to a convention and talk to a to a person. Oh, how how wh how's the weather? What do you think of the weather? It's like we are, aren't we inside? Like, what are you talking about? Oh yeah, I mean you know for when we go home later. <laughs> Gonna drink some water. Give me a sec. Ooh. Yummy, delicious water. I think I'm real. I don't know how to check, though. So what do you do? What do you mean? <laughs> Chat, is she real? Is Chat real? Man, I don't, I don't heckin' know. So tell me, anyway, tell me, what ha what were you guys up to this um, Easter Sunday and Easter Monday, I guess? I don't know if you guys had an extra day off. I know a lot of people did. I always used to get uh, the day after Easter off. So thank you. I just drank some. I didn't do anything. We love that. Just chilling. I didn't really do anything Easter related, I'd say. <laughs> Which was like on Saturday, we had like the breakfast, I guess. That was nice. But it's just nice to get like an extra day off. I got acne from all the chocolate eggs. Oh my god. I had some yesterday. They were good. Staying AFK slash idle between your history. How you you should have uh, didn't you like uh, dream uh, about me? Did you watch like your uh, streams in your dreams? Was it the movie Dream Scenario? I, I just pinged everyone so that but the I'm live so you should never remove the you should never remove the ping so you can easily find the server right <laughs> I even so I put for April Fools I put like the fake ping on the server image right and occasionally even when I clicked it myself, like when I was scrolling or going through the Discord server myself, I was like, huh? Oh, wait, that's my server. <laughs> oh, thank you. Ayo, thank you. TMT Nego Neko Gasaki, thank you so much for subscribing. And holy shit. Six months! Really appreciate it! Getting pranked by your own prank, right? Because it's just like... It's just like the small... It's just your mind going, huh? Oh, wait, duh, that's me. I did that. <laughs> uh, I decided to do it after seeing another server do it. Obviously, A4 Fools, a lot of servers are gonna do that. <laughs> I say, you know what? I'm not gonna stream on April Fool, so let me just do this small thing. I know it pisses people off, but this is so... This is such an innocent thing. Like, it's like... Uh, it's, it's, it's not bad. And I'm glad that people... Or at least... There have been a lot less of those fake graduation posts. People have been calling them out, and everyone is just kind of realizing... Yo, these suck. 
Don't mess with people's feelings like that. <laughs> I was like, mm, I did that, but not for April Fool's though. <laughs> but I won't do it again. You're such a jokester. I'm not so sure about that one. It's just like the whole freaking wide, uh, like wide image, black text, you know, like that. It's like, oh, bro. Didn't see any this year. I only saw one and everyone was shitting on that particular one. And I saw one graduation, but that was just, oh, I'm graduating from college and this is real. <laughs> so I'm, I give that one a pass. <laughs> but the other one, everyone was, but the other one was posted on like two days ago or something. The, the 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 graduation notice and the graduation stream was gonna be on april fools so that's what people were gonna be upset about did you see the shipwreck 64 april fools thing i did not but i did read your message in the discussion and uh we can we can probably check that out today because the bloody hollow fest game is pretty short I made sure to update Shipwrecked. So if you know how to access it and stuff, let me know. At least I hope it's still accessible. It's especially outrageous when they change their profile to look like the person. Oh, yeah. Or it's like they change their name. And display picture to one of, for example, like Hololive or something, and then they put on. They post a graduation notice or a termination. And it's only based on something small, like the, the I is an L or something, that you can see that it's fake. But it's just at first glance, it seems real. <laughs> But they did really like it when um, when the check marks first became a thing on Twitter, and everyone was starting to like was pretending to be like a, the the pharmaceutical company or Nintendo, and just announcing the most outrageous shit. <laughs> that was good. That was good. But everything else, yeah. Yuya reads our messages? Yes. I read almost all of the messages on Discord. Except when when there's like a long discussion, it's just one of those moments. It's like I ain't reading all that. I'm happy for you though, or sorry that it happened. <laughs> <laughs> like, if I'm not involved with the discussion anyway. <laughs> this is like, okay, cool. They're talking, they're keeping the server active, I'm happy. <laughs> the best April Fool's thing I saw was definitely the Pokemon one. Oh, you mean the Pokemon Sleep Tournament? I also really liked, um... Uh, the fake Nintendo, what was it called? Uh, the, the, the fake VR accessory. Did you get the content warning game while it was free, Yuria? Yes, of course. I'd love to play that. Uh, our collab is already in the works. But I'd also love to play it maybe with like you guys or something. The Fire Emblem Heroes one was just we have an April Fool's thing coming at the end of the a at April. What? Or it's just like we have an announcement later on?
Apparently, they added an expanded lobby mod already, but had to disable it because it overwhelmed the servers. <laughs> oh, man. I mean, if you release a free game, then yeah, that's what happens. What happened? And from what I see in the... In the reviews, it feels... Oh, there's not... Okay, actually, there's not a lot of reviews. The couple of reviews on the Steam page, I'm surprised there's only like 10. Oh no, there's way more. Why does it... Why does Steam only says... 11? Anyway, they say it's very similar to Lethal Company. But it's also funny when someone dies because it's for the content. I mean, you probably need not really grabbing stuff. Here, someone's like, the top review is this is literally little lethal company, but with landfall, silly, and amazing physics. Lethal company, but with influencers. This is just what people probably say is like people who don't play a lot of games. So it's like, oh, this is a horror game that went viral. So it's the same. <laughs> People die for content in Helldivers. I mean, like, the whole p point of the game is to make YouTube videos, right? Or, like, Spooktube. <laughs> Power was wild for their dating sim announcement. <laughs> I kinda... I saw that that was an announcement. I didn't actually see it. I, I kinda skipped through it. <laughs> Giving me Logan Paul vibes? Oh, no, 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 no. It's not that serious. It's not that serious, obviously. Person seeing second co-op horror game? I'm getting Lethal Company vibes, exactly. <laughs> Yo, Ellen Ring. It's like Zelda. It has proximity chat? Yeah, yeah, that really enhances those kind of games, so that's great. Let's go over some... Uh, the April Fool stuff. Uh-huh. Oh, there's so much <clears throat> gaming news, even actual gaming news coming out. Oh yeah, I found it, I found it. I mean, that's always the thing that happens with April Fools. Companies make things and then it's like, ah. It's like, it's a joke, but it's things that people actually kind of want. <laughs> like, oh. Maybe you should make it. Just have like dumb announcements, man. Or like wacky videos. I was okay. Switch VR. Oh, this. This is really fun. It was. 
It's a joke How many unless. Times do I have to tell you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I thought that was pretty good. <laughs> and the fucking the I linked the the grand blue one. Uh, I once played a game on stream, which was a. Uh, uh, Oh yeah, this game. And it had, like, one of those crazy fucking cutscenes. I already watched this before. Yeah! This! しかいもんじゃ。やつのやぼうだけはなんとしてでもそしせねば。正解。え、そうファキングフェイムスベイ。アイノイメル。でがでがですガイフォーキングランボ。ディスケイムスファキングワイルド。<laughs> <laughs> Present it without context. Even if you're playing the game, this is also this is still weird as fuck. Like it doesn't make a difference. <laughs> no. Okay. Did not understand this game at all. Yuriko. <laughs> I'm so lost. It's all because after that weird cutscene, there's obviously gameplay, but it doesn't explain anything. Oh, yeah, this this part. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> <It's absolutely interesting. Hi. <laughs> oh, this cutscene. <laughs> this is. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Okay, Kalan, okay, no. Oh, okay, Kalan. This is after beating the Dragon Ball. Okay, Kalan. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. 
So for this game, this is a pretty short game. You can beat it in about three hours or something. And they got every cutscene animated by a, like a different animator. So the styles of the cut, like the game just starts like, ooh, anime. And then it goes into whatever the fuck that is. Like, oh, these are the same character. <laughs> Does it have the credits too? Yeah. And then the credits is just actual girls? It's a beggar, yeah! Did they mute it for the video? For the copyright? No, <laughs> Oh no, they didn't. I think they no. Yeah, they did. They did. <laughs> but it's just this and like the same guy over and over in the credits. <laughs> Anyway, if you ever find this game, I recommend checking it out just for the absurdity of it. It's also... Uh, like an anime shorts collection, also by different directors and animators. If you, like, if you... Put the... I think it's like if you flip the disc or some shit, then it becomes... Like the the Blu-ray part and the other side is the game, something like that. It's weird. It's weird. No, no. Yeah, it's a banger. We can't find this song anywhere. <laughs> we only have the budget for two voice actors. <laughs> <laughs> it's Suraya too, too. My <laughs> auntie is great. It's true. I assume this is like the actual group or something that performs it. I have no idea. <laughs> anyway, that cutscene.
Grumblow like posted this. And it's, it's, it's the same director and animator. <laughs> it is also so fucking weird. <laughs> There's about a freaking one button combo. Easy combos. <laughs> such a fucking fever kid. <laughs> I want this person to animate like my BRB screen or something. <laughs> I saw the what was it? Uh, Nike? Is that how you pronounce it? The 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 horror Resident Evil clone stuff that I made. That's also there was a April Fool's thing also, right? Uh, probably if I type it, I'll find it. Oh. <laughs> no, it's not. Was it called? What was it called? Oh, dead, dead spicy. Bro. Shifty, begin the report. How do you make As a you BRB know, the BRB screen? <laughs> I need Sora to find a way to contact that animator. Why me? Uh, Deputy Chief, I think I hear the raptures. Press R2 or tab to detect the enemies in the surrounding area. Utilize your animal life. I, I just I saw mean, I saw this. I was just like, there's no way. This is this this is just this is not gameplay. This is this is fake. Use your amazing. It looks sense way too well. good. <laughs> a rapture. It's too much of a scene. You don't stay. But still, they could have made it like look legit. <laughs> of course, we're like Asia and stuff. You can use the rapture components to it make was already it was already weapons. april fools before the western world it wasn't it looks quite ferocious and it seems to have undergone modifications be careful hi yuri i haven't seen you in eight thousand years damn Hope you're healthy. Thank you. I hope you're good as well. Why? <laughs> Yo, it's like a um, weapon to use for self defense. Abyss school.
Man, the camera is so smooth. When I first saw this, I just kind of clicked through it, and then I like I got here. I was like, oh, never mind. I wouldn't play this even if it was real. <laughs> Fucking Stormtrooper A, what the heck? <laughs> You've worked hard, Shifty. Don't mention it. More than anything, you'll pay me for overtime, right? Abyssal is firing the game devs of tomorrow, true. Oh. It was all a dream. There's so many. Oh my god, the power... I don't... I don't even want to watch that. You know Kuni did a Suica game? Capcom Helicopters was announced. Using the RE engine. Oh yeah, the Pokemon Sleep Tournament. You're right, the the Tyranit the Tyranitar guy was freaking mocked. It looks like an ad, right? <laughs> you won't last 30 seconds good evening, in this game. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> and good night. And welcome to this first ever Pokemon Sleep Global Champion Tournament. I'm Chris. It's Pillow. like the, the obviously it's like, you could never do a Pokemon tournament or a sleep tournament. But in celebration of the tournament, quotation mark, the game still gave free shit. <laughs> like, oh, celebration, we're giving away some items. So that's nice. And this is Kenny Mattress providing live play-by-play -play of this unprecedented shut-eye scrimmage. Who would have thought this could be possible, Kenny? To be honest, I think I'm still dreaming. The slumbering superstars of Pokemon Sleep are entering their booths! Man, I do hope they don't see Each outside of it. That would be awkward. They prepare themselves for a serious night of non-stop sleep using their own unique bedtime routines. What's Midnight Slumber got? A tried and true tactic right there. Boring oneself to sleep with an overly complex book. This shut eye scuffle is off to a strong start. They've got the eight and a half so hours cute. to give us their Betty by best. And scores are based on total points awarded for speed of entering deep sleep, aka slumbering, sleep rhythm, and all around sleep style artistry. Ready. Trainers are pressing their sleep measurement buttons. So the trick here is to just Leave it on your nightstand and you win. <laughs> ah, and someone's already slumbering. Lola Baby takes an early lead. Impressive. Uh oh, Midnight Slumber seems to be struggling to fall asleep. Looks like he got a bit too curious about the ending of his this book. Is true. Always a shame <laughs> to see a strong strategy backfire. You get slumbering and easy. Triple Z sleep style is now in play. Curled up sleep. And what have we got from Siesta? Oh, ho, 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 gaping mouse sleep! That's gonna get her some extra points for sheer unbridled artistry. I'm seeing yeah, we need a to get the on Nap Ninja's face. A top belly Could sleep. How are you gonna do that? Sleep, Kenny. Kenny. It appears Kenny would rather be a contestant in this cozy competition. Not that I played him. <sighs> and, oh, and just like that, makes me sleepy too. Remain. Would you How long did I have to sleep? Midnight slumber is standing on the bed. Couldn't sleep after all. Wait, Chris, look again. He is asleep. He's just imposing sleep. What a marvel. Chris, this is a first. Amazing. This might just be what he needs to recover from his earlier insomniac upset. Lola baby has fallen off the bed. Is there any hope for recovery? Hang on. This is so fucking stupid. How is how yes, is like Yes, it's sheltered. How, how is how is that get you more it's points over. than sleeping while standing up? That's way more crazy. What an absolutely historic bedtime battle. I couldn't look away. 
you sure? I could have sworn I saw you dozing off mid-match, Kenny. Anyway, that's all for this edition of the Pokemon Sleep. The fucking production value. Keep sleeping, more, trainers. more effort has been put you into this video than the entirety of Scarlet and Violet. Sweet dreams, everybody. If they give me the opportunity to shit on those games, I will. <laughs> The tournament was scripted. How you know? How do you know? Haters will say it's fake. <laughs> Did you see the Pokemon Showdown April Fool sprites? Uh, no, I did not. All the ancient paradox bonds were just outdated memes where they just like rage faces and stuff. Dude, there's even a freaking metabots April Fools. I'm sure this is just like one of those things that people actually want. <laughs> Fucking devil man! Please just make a new game. <laughs> like, is this fake? Like, this, this is fake, but they went through all the trouble to make, get the artwork and stuff, and the models. <laughs> Fucking Klungo! Why would they lie to us? Because <laughs> that looks pretty real. so much. Among Us did everything. Everyone has long necks for a week. I mean, that's pretty, that's pretty cute. Do people still play Among Us? Among Us. <sighs> this Japanese mockumentary actually really freaked me out. It was an hour long. God Finally, damn. this half hour. Patch oh, this is really gonna block. I just want to see this fucking cat. A moment, K Ford will never Holy forget. Holy shit! By now, many of you know who this guy is. Looked at it. There was clearly a picture that was attached to it, and I opened it up, and there he was. And I have patches. Holy shit! <laughs> 
<laughs> Poor cat. A lot of these videos that have been showing up in my recommendations is like, um, is, is clips from that stream where you can uh, donate or something and you feed them and they give them all names and they name them cars instead of cats. <laughs> they would do such a thing to their own cats. I don't even get, how does it get this far? This is from 11 months ago. Was it now? Patches the cat. Now! <laughs> he can now walk on the stairs. <laughs> I watched it. I love this channel. For today's groom. I needed to get my forklift certificate. Oh, but it's still on a leash! This is Brian, <laughs> and although he looks like a sumo wrestler, he is in fact a cat. Good kitty. You're okay. <laughs> posing to more, be more difficult than I thought. He's here today because trying to groom himself... You gotta show this to Corinne. <laughs> doing a sit -up. So he needs He's a definitely not that big. A bit of a mess, mister. Do uh, not attempt any fancy escapes. He can't even Sorry, escape. Buddy. It's too large. It's okay, Brian. You've got some really bad dandruff. I don't think you've cleaned yourself in a decade. I wish I could put him in the cat bath, but he most certainly will not fit in it. I wonder how much this cat weighs. I'm gonna say around. Must be such a nice pillow. Meow. 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 It's all I can do is all, all I can do okay, is just yell, kind of complain. Like it's super. It's such a sweet cat really too. It doesn't try to attack her or bite her. <laughs> no. There's no he way. He says I'm that. Really yeah, bad. kinda. The force of nature. It's oh my okay. god. You're okay, Brian. No. <laughs> Don't get any ideas. <laughs> Should we get him a happy hoodie? <laughs> okay, he's getting a second shampoo and Pro Hex from the vet. <laughs> what a good so bad. Because he's got Woody. something going on with his skin. I feel like he's wide enough to be someone's footstool. Buddy, stop crying. You're making me sad. It's okay, buddy. It's almost over. Man, they're being okay, fucking murdered. The bath is over. It's over. I don't even think fat is the right term to use for this size of a cat. Luckily, he still fit in the rage cage. When I asked the owners why Brian was the size of a cruise ship, they told me he beats up his first siblings and steals their food. Apparently, Brian is actually starving. We'll feed them in a different room! Poor thing! She keeps insulting it! <laughs> Due to his size, I didn't think I had much to be concerned about in regards to retaliation. But I was wrong. Oh God. I feel like getting smacked in the face by Brian would be the equivalent of a bear claw. <laughs> Still got tons of dandruff. I wonder how it is as oh, uh, less, no. like watching this as the owner. <laughs> it's like, damn, she was insulting my fucking cat. <laughs> the acro groomer is working pretty well to get rid of a lot of that dandruff. See that? Much better it is now. We should have weight loss TV shows for cats. He'd be the number one star. 
An interesting thing about fat cats is that they are actually easier for groomers to work on. Their rotund size means the only thing they run to is their food bowl, and their lard actually stretches out their skin, making it less likely to get caught in our clipper blades. <laughs> Usually, would you do them if it was core? I mean, at this point, you know cat. what you're signing up with, right? If you're gonna... <laughs> if you're gonna have her as your groomer. Well, your butt is gross. I really wanted to know how much Brian actually weighs. So I stepped on the scale first without him, and then I picked him up, because there ain't no way he's fitting on this scale on his own. Holy man, this cat's friggin' heavy. Holy shit. 30 pounds? 30 pounds. <laughs> Thank you all so much for Holy watching. Holy shit. I hope you enjoyed the blubbery Brian. <laughs> you. <laughs> this, this one too is so. Come here, stinky. Stinky. That's what I call Corin. Stinky. Have you weighed Corin? Mm, All right. No, not so in a while. So today we are grooming Marley. Mar he used to be. So I think he was six kilos. He was six kilos when I brought him to Canada. Why do they put those things on their head? Oh, it calms them down. They just can't hear, I guess. Marley is a domestic short hair. Obviously, as you guys can see, Marley is very overweight. And because of that, she can't clean herself or groom herself properly. So she needs a good grooming today. Something tells me she's really going to enjoy this because she loves being touched. You're going to be a good cat. Kind of looks like Corinne. Good <laughs> kitty. Oh, you are purring. I never get cats purring in here. They usually just hate me. Look how small your head is compared to your body. Oh, oh the flop. The flop. So cute. Can I clip your nails? I'm going to give you a treat in a second. Oh, no. I'm going to distract you with some treats first. Do you like treats? Your size tells me that you do. But that doesn't necessarily mean anything. Here, you like treats? OK, come over here. Of course she does. <laughs> well, that worked. That's what I do with Corin right. if I want to well. get um, the leash on him. If I put... Because uh, he has like a harness, right? That needs to go under his like little paws, arm, and around his chest. And he hates, he hates it when I pick up his leg to... Uh, you know, to put on the harness. But if I give him a treat, then he lets me do whatever the fuck I want to him. <laughs> oh, that was if I welcome. Two, so let's do the other two. He gets pissed side. if I pick him up otherwise, the but nails. your front nails might be a bit doing of a, a treat. It's like, oh, okay. <laughs> Here. Now, Chubby Kitty here has a lot of poop on her butt. It looks so sad the with the on the way freaking here. head. So I really need to get her into the bath. I am going to wear gloves for this wonderful experience. Please do your best not to murder me in the bathtub, okay? Their head's so small. So not the chubbiest cat on the channel. <laughs> but the push cat. There. Huh. <laughs> I can't even get you in the tub. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Okay, okay. It's okay. Oh, and there goes the bathtub. Let go, bro. Stay calm, okay? Try and stay calm. Good kitty, Marley. Good girl. It's okay. <laughs> Man, you're murdering them. No, no, no. No, no, no. Wait. Wait. Okay. Okay. Clean the butt. Oh, okay. Fine. Fine. Nope. 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 When cats are chubby like this, they are really, really strong. 
Either they are chubby and they just don't care and they give up, or they use their weight to an advantage. And they have nothing to hold on to because Wrestler they're so stretched out because they are so overweight. So it can be a challenge if they decide they don't want to stay in the tub. I kind of wish that there was something invented, kind of like the rage cage, but for bathing, where it keeps the cat contained. Stop trying to scratch me. It's not Ooh, nice. the little tongue. <laughs> don't corner if you like. Just don't try to do any fancy movements. If your head is I mean, it's still surprisingly smart. like calm. Good girl. You're shedding a lot. It, it has so given much up. Hair in the rage cage. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay, Marley. <laughs> Sound like you're rinsing this towel on top of her so that she can't see. Okay. My cat was 21 or last time. Too soon. 21 pounds. How much? Uh, we have know, a lot of funny is. videos on my channel of chubby cats and making jokes about them. 21 pounds. Um, obviously, it's important for people to know that having an overweight cat is dangerous for their health. I don't know this cat. I don't know if oh, she like has nine. a thyroid condition. I don't know if she's been. Hey, that's adopted. also pretty large. So we're not going to go ahead and make any judgments to the owner but educational comments about why overweight pets is dangerous is okay and i'm sure like they're here obviously getting the cat groomed because they know that the cat has having trouble cleaning him herself I get why it's called the rage cage. <laughs> I'm a cat, cat grooming, uh, oh, no. pet, cr pet grooming YouTuber now. We just, just watch so animal grooming videos. You know, there would be a lot of cats that would be severely disappointed over that. Just so you know. Mm. I'm going to give My you one. a brush. You are shedding like crazy, and I think you will like this brush because you like to be pet. This is making me want to get a cat. <laughs> a really good cat, but you cannot run away. And I would highly suggest that you do not attempt jumping off. This the is table. definitely what Corin would look like if you if you refed him on the little legs pancake. He's splat on the table. <laughs> She lost a lot of hair in the drying cage. She's about to lose a lot more. She has some little matting on her back that I'm gonna have to get through with this comb. You'll see how it pulls. Yeah. She's happy now. <laughs> Stay on the table though, okay? Oh. This would be Corin okay. if you put a fe feeder power Powered by donations. Sorry, yep. Sounds here. about right. Please, please I would don't. not feed him anymore. I love how you're okay with it pretty well everywhere else. It's so pretty. Look she at the fur. What a handsome butt. kitty. How am I going to do that if you're mad? You let me touch it? No. No. I'm going to try to shave it. Yeah, give us the gross. freaking cat butt so view. So much hair came out of this area when I was blow drying you. Yeah. Alright, so she has matting in her back legs that needs to come out. So I am going to put the bubble. <laughs> Poor <laughs> I still know I can. <laughs> push her for Hide her right? head. Hopefully. <laughs> I'm trying to go quick, kitty kitty. Like, if you don't see the problem, the problem doesn't exist, right, kitty? It's okay. She makes it look so fun. And it looks satisfying, you know, right? This spot, that's for sure. Okay. 
I know. Honestly, I'm always just amazed to see how these creatures behave. It because when nice. I try to it put Corin nice into a bath, he will just... Okay. So that part's done. Do um, everything he can to get the heck out of there. Turn her. It's okay. Oh. Okay. You can support the channel by hitting that subscribe. She is not a loaf. She is a whole darn bakery. <laughs> Have you tried these methods with Corinne? You... She want me to purchase what she call it a happy hoodie, <laughs> or the the space uh the space ball coin uh, uh what do you call it I don't know cone cone <laughs> the space helmet on throne <laughs> let me see if that exists Amazon cat. Uh Yes Kitten Space Hood <laughs> Cat muzzle for grooming cat transparent cat hood breathable cat space hood for cats on surgical recovery anti bite wound Yes many of these exist and then one, and I don't. What am I? What the fuck am I gonna use it for? <laughs> I don't really have to groom Corin. The only time I have had to do that is when he. I think maybe at that time I was like I was a yeah I was a streamer back then too like he. He walked into my room to sleep on my bed and my bed was suddenly covered in, you know, fucking cat shit or something that he stepped in. Maybe it was dog poop. I don't know. He was covered in poop, so had to wash him. <laughs> and he hates it. But yeah, it's only when stuff like that happens. You have to watch a cat. It's not really something that you have to do often. And cats that are really, really fat, like, because they lick themselves, right? They just can't reach these places anymore. There's too much roundness in the way, so they can't groom. And that's why cats like this need to go to a groomer. Because they simply cannot do it themselves. But yeah, a lot of the tools that she uses look really look really neat. The rage cage. <laughs> like that's like just like a dryer, right? Th those exist like in like smaller capacities. Holy shit, yeah, here's one. Pet dryer box. Three hundred dollars. Holy shit. But you cannot get them they they have to sit in it. I mean, obviously they have to, but it's like open. Here's one that's like closed. $740. Wow. It looks like a space pod. And here's like one of the, oh, I think like the box that this lady uses or something similar. That's not that expensive. It's like a hundred. But it's just, it's just a box. Like you need to get the other parts for the drying and stuff separate. So we get the matching helmet and he's like a little cat astronaut. No, oh, I feel bad. <laughs> My cat once spread cat poop on every surface on the lounge. That was fun to find in the morning. <laughs> it was, this was Sunday when uh, we were doing the watch along. So he pooped and I closed the bathroom door because I didn't want the smell to come into the rest of the living area. And then later, I went to the bathroom myself. 
And I saw there was just like so much poop. There was like poop on the wall. What the fuck? I won't show it. It was just a turd that was on the wall and it was kind of like white. I think what he did, because because there was litter on it, that he tried to actually do it in a litter box, but it kind of stuck to his butthole. So he tried to wipe it off on the fucking wall. <laughs> Just like once before, he tried to wipe his ass on the carpet and I got pissed at him. So he stopped. <laughs> he, he, he hasn't done that since. So his next solution was to use the wall. <laughs> <laughs> and it was so disgusting. You ever been to a gas station restaurant? It was like that. Ew. No, I have not. I have not. Core needs a bidet. Uh, he really does. He's very much... He hates water. Speaking of, like, it's finally uh, getting a bit warmer here. It's not as cold. So yesterday, I had the door open so I could throw away my trash. I was, I was taking the trash out. And uh, when I got back, Corinne was like sitting near the door. And I was like, you know what? You want to go outside? And he very cautiously like stepped outside. And uh, he explored the garage a bit and smelled like everything. <laughs> Until a car drove by and he got spooked and I had to... I, I brought him back inside. But once he was back inside, he was so happy. You could you could notice it in his step. He was like walking up and down the stairs like, Oh, I'm so happy. And he was uh, he was meowing at guys. He's like, Oh, I went outside. <laughs> he was so excited. <laughs> it was so cute. And I think this time he, he liked it because he wasn't on a leash. He just hates being on a leash, I guess. So I'll I'll try it I'll try it again sometime. I just have to be near him so I can pick him up whenever like a car comes or something. <laughs> Because when this was like last week, I tried to take him outside and he went in the snow and he hated it and he was just climbing on me like, No, take me back inside, please. I don't want to be here, but it was also freaking minus 20. It was super cold. So now it's like fine. It's not that bad. Okay, uh, let's, uh, play some games. You're so cute. <laughs> <laughs> it's puddles everywhere. Ah, uh, not so much, at least here yet. There's still a shit ton of fucking snow. Oh my god, this can be good for your back. <laughs> that is so cute. <laughs> like how do how the heck are these cats like that? These are these are those cats that you always like she stacks like oranges on them and they just keep sleeping. <laughs> Farmer cats. Please remove your hand, lady. That seems dangerous. So cute. <laughs> Is 
It's in a fucking basket. And they're always just near her. the entire fucking video. Well, this one's yours now. <laughs> These are just partly human or something. There's no way. How are they all like this? <laughs> The lady is a witch. <laughs> okay. Hello. She's feeding them tea. Special tea. <laughs> Okay, uh, yeah, I'll take a real small break so I can go pee. Maybe get another drink? Yeah, I'll be right back. And then we play game. Beer bee!
I peed. Hi. <laughs> Welcome back, Pete. No. Pete, 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 Peter. Thank you. <laughs> <clears throat> Congratulations. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Okay. Booting up. The game. Sorry, it's kind of loud. Let me lower it. Okay. Ugh. So this is like... 80 horror? 80s horror? Oh, holy shit! Anonymous just gifted five subs. Holy shit, thank you! What the heck? And on the anniversary is over. <laughs> thank you for the five gift subs! What the fuck? <clears throat> thank you! Everybody, please enjoy your gift up. Is it too loud? Definitely too loud. Okay. <clears throat> Let's go! Hello? Mr. Beast. <laughs> Hello? Who is it? It's me, Yuria. Hi, Miku! <laughs> it's me, Yuria. Being true to who you are makes all your dreams possible. Oh. It's me, Jeff. <laughs> you were supposed to be... At the camp hours ago. Oh shit. Sorry, Jeff. I overslept again. Uh, I knew it. Tot, you hear that? Pay up my 20 bucks. I won the bet. You bet that I would oversleep? Relax. You get 50%. By the way, since I knew this would happen, I told Tyler an hour ago to pick you up at the bus stop. You know, the one near your house. Oh. Bitch, I can't see! Bitch, snap There's nothing! Me. Bitch, I can't fucking see! Well, thanks, Jeff. I better grab my stuff and not keep Tyler waiting. Hey, Todd, hand over the 20 bucks. I can't go home. I have to meet Tyler. Okay. Very suspicious... ...looking area, I must say. Trash can. That's correct. It is very dark. Name's Jeff. Can I up the brightness? Okay, this will be better. I assume this way. Man, the streets are so empty. Oh, this looks like a bus stop. Oh. What's the picture in the trash can? Huh. The police are investigating the disappearance of three young women in the last seven days. Three women aged between 20 and 24. have got missing this week. A resident in the area claims that on the night of the disappearances, he spotted a strange individual lurking around the vicinity in one of the, her homes. However, due to poor lighting in the area, just up the brightness. This is, this is what happens 
women. <laughs> he could not make a positive identification. The city is by bewildered by these events. The authorities have advised residents to avoid going out after dark. Secure the doors and windows and report any suspicious activity to the emergency hotline. Oh my god! Damn, what a scare! What are you doing here alone? Is that guy just not wearing pants? Buses don't run this late. Could you get out of my face? Hmm. Has no one ever taught you not to approach people? Oh, no, no, wait. This is the girl. Has no one ever taught you to not approach people like that? <laughs> are you waiting for someone? It's none of your business. I'm waiting for a girl. On second thought, I think I've already found her. What are you talking about? I love working at night. The silence. The city changes completely. Dude, you're nuts. Oh, he's just wearing pink pants. Very, very tight, think... <laughs> pink pants. Pink panther. It's now time to read with that creepy guy standing around. Skinny jeans. Yeah, you're right. Okay. So what am I supposed to do? Guess I'll just wait for my bus? Dude, how about you continue your walk? Or they said he was waiting for someone. Why are we still sitting here? Oh. Okay. Lucky timing. <laughs> Bye, bitch. Where did I go? Excuse me. I'm just exploring, bro. Bro, Tyler. Hey, Maya. Who's that guy? I don't know, but he gave me the creeps. There's some really weird people around here. Come on, get in. Oh my god. And here we are, one more year. What's the plan? We gotta finish decorating the place with Halloween stuff and get some... Get some games ready for tomorrow. But don't worry, there's plenty of time to get everything sorted. Go drop your stuff at stuff off at the cabin and meet us at the dining hall. Find your cabin and leave your backpack, okay? How do I know which one's mine? This is not my cabin. Couldn't they have told us? Ah! Damn. That's, uh, wood, all right. What we got here? It's a screwdriver. Okay, I feel like these are tools that I might need at some point. Uh, very dark. Let's close the door. Why the fuck... ...do they have this? <laughs> Why would that be something that you have at like a... ...camp? Decoration. It's for games. We're gonna play Hangman. Don't you know?
You know, I know a better song they can dance to. He got the schmooves! You guys heard of this song called You're the Only One? <laughs> By the Yuria of Alurus? No, tell me more. Wait. I'll have you listen. I've been listening to it nonstop, really? I want to see what it looks like on the dance to it. Look at them! <laughs> it's close. The third guy is me. This is how most people dance at places. <laughs> Is this the first song? I need to change it to the second one. His face. <laughs> then we're getting lit! I can't walk past it. Yeah, let's go. Where should you be twerking? You shouldn't be twerking! <laughs> Nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn, these guys can go on for a long time. <laughs> okay, okay. Okay, how about... <laughs> All right. 
Hey, Maya, dance a little. Just did. You finally arrived. Come on, I have something to show you. Okay. Maya, welcome. Welcome! <laughs> Is she gonna show me that thing that we just talked about? And I don't think it's to hang me. Well, it is in a way. But not for... to eat. Come on. Is this, uh, the room you were just in? Yep. How's life in your new city? Did you get the job you wanted? Yeah. Though it turned out to be a, to be crap, like every job I've had so far. Sometimes I think I should have stayed in town and continued with the family business. Why are you working at her parents' bar for her whole life? No way! You've always been a rebel, but also the smartest... ...among us. You just have to keep trying. You'll get what you're looking for in the end. You think so? I'm sure. Uh... What is that? What do you think? Wow, is this what you had to show me? Yep, I'm wearing it tonight. Oh, it's a bra and pennies. <laughs> I didn't see... <laughs> ...what it was. Who's the lucky one? She's gonna say... You. You. Oh, Jeff. Fucking Jeff. Okay. <laughs> You're dating Jeff? Shh, the others don't know yet. I don't want us to be subject of their jokes tonight. Damn it, Jeff! Since when? Not long, just a week. Despite being a joker and seeming like a jerk at times, he's a romantic. Maya, Beth, let's all gather by the fire. Join us. Ready for our annual horror story session? I guess so. Let's go. Maybe we should grab a screwdriver. Nope. So which one is Jeff? All right, everyone's here. I'm sure you've all heard about the counselor who lost his life in this very camp 20 years ago. His name was... Derek. It all started as a prank by the other counselors. On a night like this. Also, during the preparations for the Halloween party. The counselors thought it would be fun to play a prank on Derek. But first, they had to spook him. So they all gathered by the fire to tell a horror story, just like we are doing right now. One of the counselors told the story of the pumpkin killer. The pumpkin killer? Yeah, it's an old legend. My grandma told... Oh, grandpa told me about it when I was a kid. Many years ago, in the town, they found a witch and burned her alive. But before she died, the witch said every year, at midnight, right at the beginning of October 31st, her spirit would return to seek revenge on everyone. It's said that the curse brings back a serial killer who can't be hurt or killed. His head is covered by a pumpkin and no one ever has ever seen his face. After finishing the story, one of the girls started screaming, pointing towards the trees and there he was, the pumpkin killer, holding a bloody axe. Everyone started screaming and running, but the killer was only after Derek, who ran to his cabin and locked himself in. One of the counselors cut the power, and then everyone surrounded the cabin, banging on the walls. Leave me alone! I haven't done anything! Derek shouted from inside the cabin. You could also hear him crying. Then... Everything fell silent. After a few seconds, Derek's friends started laughing and shouting, It's a prank, Derek. You can come out. We're sorry. 
But Derek didn't answer or open the cabin door. Faced with the silence, the counselors started to worry, so they turned the power back on. One of the guys entered through the windows to find out what was happening. Derek was dead. The one who pretended to be the pumpkin pill... The pumpkin pillar, I was gonna say. The pumpkin killer was one of Derek's roommates. It seemed that while he was picking out the axe for the prank, he left the others lying on the ground. Due to the panic and darkness, Derek tripped and fell headfirst onto the only X whose edge was pointing upward. His friends found him in a pool of blood with his head split in half. Then... How? Damn, Tyler, not funny! Ha 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 ha! Alright, enough of the stories. We need to get to work. Maya. There's still some decorations left to put up. Can you place some pumpkins at the entrance? I think there are still some in the lake cabin. Sure. How does that work? D did was he hanging from the tree? <laughs> Freaking Spider-Man. All right. Uh Lakeside. That's the entrance. Man, quite a walk. <sighs> Thank you for stretch. For some reason, my shoulder is kind of sore. I don't know... What or why? Oh. Uh, maybe other... Oh. I was like, what is that? Oh. Ew. You two should head to your cabin. Oh shit, we've been busted. Relax, Maya knows. What? You told her? Maya's a good friend, she won't say anything. I'm a tomb? What? I'm a tomb? Come on, Jeff. You and I have something pending. Oh, Maya, could you do me a favor? What do you need? Jeff and I were supposed to pick up the Halloween piñata and hang it on the gallows. Could you take care of it? Fuck you! Do it yourself! I guess so. Where is it stored? In the workshop near the Forbidden area. Oh my god, the Forbidden Woods. You mean the old workshop? Yes, they haven't started building the new one yet. Weren't they supposed to construct it this summer? That was the plan initially, but the guys couldn't gather enough money. Uh, I see. Alright, I'll hand it a piñata once I'm done placing the pumpkins. Thanks! Interesting. Nice looking water in this game. And this way, no. What could possibly go wrong? Wow, a template. Gaming time. There we go. Now I need to find a lighter. Maybe Tyler has one. I'll ask him. Okay, where would this guy be? Inside of his own cabin? Tyler! Hello! Nope. Hello! Can I walk in on those? On a couple? No. I wonder if we get a flashlight. Oh, he's over there. I, I wanna I wanna see anyway. <laughs> 
You can go in each room. Oh, this one has posters. Whatever that's supposed to be. Oh, this is ours. What are these? Lighters? Take one of these. Tyler, do you have a lighter? I left it with Todd. Go check inside. Do you have Tyler's lighter? I needed to light some pumpkins. I left it at one of the tables. Okay, yay. Oh, now we can look inside those dark rooms. Oh. It's like a little bathroom. Why are they so dark? There's a window. Too fast. Very cute. Are you gonna be on the entire night? Time to get the piñata, but first I have to return Tyler's lighter to Todd. Okay. Now this is gameplay. Put it down. Okay. Look for the workshop. That's probably where the game told me it shouldn't be this far ahead. Or oh, probably there. Got me a little bit, but like the sound was loud. <laughs> Oh, this is the piñata? So is this a, a thing that kids actually go to a summer camp? Ow. Well, I guess now we know what this is for. Or like, I guess, an, a, a Halloween can. Done. I didn't think there's much more to do. I'll go see if they need help in a dining hall. I went to like a camp once. And uh, it was just uh, one large cabin. Pretty much. And there were... There were two rooms, just one for boys and one for girls, just like to sleep in. With like a bunch of bunk beds. And that's it. <laughs> and the rest of the activities were just outside. Was very small. Hey Maya, grab a beer and join the party. Is this what you call a party? Where's Tyler? He said he was looking for you at the workshop. That you got lost. He'll be back when he sees you're not there. What's wrong with the lights? Back when I was in Boy Scouts? Yo! That's real. Do you know if the generator has fuel? What's wrong? I activated it this afternoon, but I forgot to check the fuel level. Great! At least we have the pumpkins. Yeah, pumpkins. What do we do now? 
I mean, it's quite cozy. Someone has to go to the generator. Here, take Tyler's lighter. What do you mean, take Tyler's lighter? Don't you plan on coming with me? You mean? No way. I'm not going in the dark to the generator. Oh, come on. What's that smell? Oh, I know. I think you've crapped yourself. You should change your pants while I attract all the other flies around here. Haha, <laughs> look at me laughing. Pretty, pretty funny, actually. I mean, it's uh, pretty nice, just the pumpkins. Oh. I thought you got lost. I went to look for you. What happened to the lights? I forgot to check the fuel level of the generator. Typical of him. By the way, where is he? He stayed in a dining hall. He's too scared to go to the generator in this darkness. <sighs> Hopeless. I'll go with you. Thanks! Where are Jeff and Beth? Busy. Busy? I think they're still with the decorations. Games for tomorrow and all that. Ah oh, well, I thought we were done. Apparently not. There should be gas in the workshop. Go ahead and check the generator. I'll be there soon. Okay. Okay, I'll wait here. Tyler, can you hear me? Yeah, what's up? The generator is broken. What do you mean? Someone cut the cables. Are you sure? Maybe a rat chewed on them. The cuts are clean. It couldn't have been a rat. Wait, I'm coming to see. <coughs> Tyler, are you okay? Tyler? Crap, what's happening? We are totally safe. There is nothing wrong. Oh my god! Oh my goodness! Oh my godness. I hope this isn't Jill's blood. Oh my god, did they hang another piñata? Yeah. Oh my god, it's Todd! Oh my god, Todd, who could have done something like this? I have to find the others. Beth! Maybe you should take out this weapon. What's their cabin? Beth, open the door! Beth! I'm coming in, damn it! Uh. Maria, what's going on? I'm busy. I need to call the police. Someone was... Someone murdered Todd. And Tyler is missing. Alright, Maya. I don't have time for jokes. Look outside. I'm... It's not a joke. I'm telling you, Todd is dead. Someone killed him and hung him in the damn gallows. Fine, Maya. Whatever you say. Now I have to get back inside and continue what I was doing. Jeff, are you okay? Jeff? Name's Jeff. Give me a second. <coughs> uh. Need something to cut the damn chain. Yes, this. The bolt cutter. <laughs> damn, he was naked too. I'm so sorry, girl. Anyway... Can I see from the other side? <laughs> Beth, we need to call the police! I was dead! I know, and I'm sorry, but we need to tell someone or we'll be next. Beth, you, you need you to react. Fine, I'm sorry, can you call the police? <laughs> It's a screwdriver, damn. You good, bro? You should take him off the fucking glass. Oh god. Jump scared me. My phone- the phone isn't working. I think someone cut the line. 
What about the phone in your cabin? I don't think it's a good idea. Whoever is doing all this must have destroyed all the phones. They don't want anyone leaving. What the hell do we do, Maya? The cars, right. The damn cars. Where are the keys? I don't know. Tyler stored them somewhere. They could be in his cabin. Are you sure? No, I'm not sure of anything. Okay, I'll go check. I'm coming with you. I'm not staying in here. <coughs> Fucking bastard! Need something to remove the screws. Oh, what a coincidence. Oh, is that not a ladder? You can climb over the wood. Where could Tyler have put the keys? Oh, this is Tyler's room? No, not again. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Seems like he's gone. Where the hell are those damn keys? The keys are not in the cabin. Think, Maya. Maybe I can cross the lake with one of the canoes. I think there are some houses on the other side. Maybe they can help me. Honestly, kind of smart. But I would be way too afraid to step outside. I guess we're fine. That's a red lighter. Can I use that one? <laughs> Hit him with the bowl cutters. Yeah. Oh. Tyler, you're alive. Are you okay? Someone attacked me when I left the workshop, but I managed to escape. I think I have cuts all over my body. Where are the others? They're all dead. Beth, Jeff, Todd. This is a nightmare. Where are the canoes? I don't know. I ran to get one of the, one and the cr to cross the lake, but they weren't here. I don't understand what's happening. I don't know. Maybe you just fucking swim. The camp gate's locked. The car keys are missing. Phones don't work, and the canoes are gone. How are we supposed to get out of here? Swim? The lake is too big to swim across. We'd freeze and drown before we make it to the other side. Oh. Exactly. We have no way to escape. We're both going to die. There has to be some way. Of course, why didn't I think of it before? The Forbidden Zone! The Forbidden Woods. What's there that can help us? Have you ever heard the story of the tunnel? What tunnel? What are you talking about? When I was a kid, my father told me that children from the camp started disappearing, but later they'd reappear. This went on for several days. One day, a counselor secretly followed them and discovered the kids had found an old tunnel hidden in the ground. Apparently, the tunnel led to the other side of the road. Do you know how to get to the tunnel? I only know it's in a forbidden zone, under one of the cabins. But I don't even know if the tunnel really exists. Maybe it was just a story. You don't seem to have many other options. We should check if what you were told is true. Fine, let's get going. I hope you know how to get there. I could barely find a workshop. Don't worry, I know the way, but stay close to me. He's gonna die. Gonna have a sip. Oh, it doesn't pause the game. Oh, okay. Never mind. He he stops. I'm thirsty. There's so much talking. This is... I, I... This is the worst. I can't walk past him. Huh? 
What was that? Hello, is someone there? Shut up, idiot. What if it's the killer and he hears us? Killer? You better hurry, let's go. Tyler, wait! Damn it, Tyler. What was that lie? Like, freaking Ganondorf? Huh? This, uh... This tree texture looks kinda out of place compared to the rest of the trees. Try to have us up. Where did Tyler go? It's a ray trace tree. Are these like old cabins or is that blood? Safe. I need to figure out a combo. Nothing. Today marks one year since Jack's death. We all miss him and feel guilty, especially me. I'll never forgive myself for suggesting that prank. Maybe I should have told the police instead of claiming it was an accident. I can't stop having nightmares since it happened. Sometimes I think I shouldn't come back to this camp anymore. The longer I stay here, the worse the nightmares get. Why would you stay there when someone has been murdered? Tomorrow, I'm going to suggest moving it near the lake. I'm sure others will agree with me. Today, I talked to the rest of the group about relocating the camp near the lake. Everyone thought it was a fantastic idea. So in September, we'll start preparing the ground and building new cabins. This morning, my wife came to visit, and I got a pleasant surprise when she brought Maya with her. Oh my god, that's our character! We're going to stay around for a couple of days. I'm sure both of them will have a great time. This afternoon, Wayne tried to blow his head off. No one knew he brought a gun to the camp. Spencer had been warning us for days that Wayne's behavior was strange. Claimed he seemed depressed. So he's been keeping an eye on him. This afternoon, he saw Wayne wander a bit uh, away from the camp and followed him without noticing. When he got far enough, Wayne pulled out a revolver and he was lucky Spencer followed him. Thanks to him, he's still alive. We all gathered to talk to him to help him, but he needs more than our help. He's also broken by Jack's death. Feeling almost as guilty as I do. Okay, the revolver is in the safe. Ugh. <sighs> In my cabin, I left a combination written on a laminated card inside the well bucket. Okay. Excuse me. So, I need to find the well, but I'm curious. I want to look in all of these. Inside is lit, but the door is closed. Tyler, are you in there? It's lit. Wish I can't see. Here's the well. Well, well, well. 
I need something to retrieve the bucket. Maybe a hook like one Todd used to hang pumpkins. There might be one in the workshop. Oh my god, I gotta run all the way back? Welcome. Okay, there wasn't it wasn't that far. <laughs> oh no there is most <coughs> I'm dead. <laughs> that was rude. It was. I like how the the killer is just pumpkin, the pumpkin killer, pumpkin head. It's like the mon the the, the most non threatening thing. Oh, I was like, where did he go? <laughs> He's just chilling. Is he going back inside? Huh. Oh, well, whatever. It's okay, you let me go this time. <laughs> <coughs> Okay, where was the well? I'm really glad there's no, like, stamina meter. Okay. Well. Well, well, well. Is it this one? Get this fucking gun. Here it is. Yeah. Should probably check the gun. I assume it opens this. Seems suspicious. Today marks 20 years since your death. <coughs> what? I have been living all this time with a strong hatred in my heart. But finally, the day has come to let it all out. To avenge those who took you away from me and mom. Oh, I do this to honor your memory and mom. She took her own life shortly after you left. Now those who still survive will feel what I felt. When I snatch the lives of their children, their lives will be left in darkness, just like mine was extinguished. With love, Tyler. Oh my god, it's Tyler! 
Hey, Maya. Surprise? I see you're at loss for words. Did you know it was your father who ended my father's life? I've been waiting for this day for years, and it's finally here. They'll finally feel what I felt after all these years, and my father can rest in peace. You're sick. I'm so sick that I'll chop you into pieces with this axe and send you home to your parents in a box. I would love to see what the looks of their on their faces when they see what's inside. You're insane. You're a damn psychopath. Am I the psychopath? Your father started all this. My mother took her own life after my father's death. I became an orphan. And I'm the psychopath? <laughs> <sighs> You've murdered your friends. They weren't guilty of anything. Of course not. It's not personal against you guys, but against your parents. <laughs> oh, that didn't stop him. You have to see this fucking cutscene. Oh. Oh, no! This is going great. You get bad aim. It's because I clicked through the dialogue. <laughs> okay. I guess I do have to walk away. Do you have to immediately just run out of there? What's the way to go? Oh, she... He blocked a door. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> this is so awkward. <laughs> Damn, this guy's really resilient, though. Oh, oh. Shot him in the balls! How you like that? How many fucking times do I have to shoot this guy? Oh, okay. <laughs> it's the ball shell that got him. This part of the floor seems more fragile than the rest. Okay. Kill him! I mean, he was already dead, actually. Okay. But her father is not the original pumpkin killer, right? Oh, thank you. Like, wasn't that like someone... Someone got murdered and... They... Or, like, it was a joke. And then some actual guy... Killed them. Are you still alive? Where do you think you're going? Uh, I'm, I'm, I wanna, I'm gonna go to McDonald's. You want anything? You won't be able to get out of here without the key I have in my pocket. What? Wow. 
Why would someone enter the tunnel the killer told her about? Right? Oh, right. He probably knows the way. Oh, God. Where does fucker go? Oh, that is. Good night. Oh, I have to interact with the... Why are you running? Why are you running? How many times I have to shoot him, I wonder. Oh my. <laughs> I clicked. I shot him. Let's take it slowly then. I was I was gonna complain about the fact that you can't really hear him. But you sort of can. When he gets close to you. And at least he turns around. Never mind, it's very hard to hear him. You ran in here, it's like the end. Teleporting motherfucker. Might be a bit easier. Come on, bro, where's your girl? Yay! Are you dead this time? Also, didn't we take the axe earlier? <laughs> Did we just leave it there? I must have been walking for about 10 minutes. Maybe we should run. This looks like a nice little road during the day.
Looks like a vehicle's coming. Oh my god, is the guy with the sunglasses gonna pick us up? It's just, he's, we're just gonna get hit by the car and the game's over. Thank god, I need help! What's going on? Someone has murdered my friends. What are you talking about? Please, I need to speak to the police. Oh my god, come on, just get in the car. This is suspicious. There's an intersection up ahead. When you get there, turn right. About five kilometers away, there's a police station. Don't worry, I know the area. Thank you. <laughs> this car is very slow. <laughs> Like, we might have... we might as well just have been walking. <laughs> so, uh, you come here often? No? Uh, the weather's nice, huh? Uh, do you have any questions about what happened, perhaps? You're probably a witness. Oh my god! You missed your intersection. You totally missed it. Hey, I'm talking to you. <laughs> oh, it's the guy from the beginning. Damn, let me out! Oh my god! It was the guy at the beginning who killed us! It's the guy from the news article! <laughs> yeah, it was fun. A uh, pretty fun game. <laughs> for, what it, for what it is. <laughs> Is there an after credit scene? No. Another game beaten by the Yuria of Iluris. Yeah, it's it's, it's like it I don't know who could play. It's a cute little game. I... Uh, I'm glad I wasn't stuck in the maze for a long time. I, I had a feeling it's like, oh, watch me like die over and over again and I'm gonna get frustrated. But that wasn't the case. It was very doable. <laughs> okay, let me leave, delete these. So I have some other titles. I have Barbotine. One of the one of you guys linked it also in my Discord. Oh, I can do the the shipwrecked stuff. I noticed you used the maze trick. Oh, hold, looking like holding right. <laughs> okay, let, let's do it. Shipwrecked. And then we can play the other one. Okay, you have to tell me what to do. What do you mean? This is a game for children.
Oh, okay, thank you. Think outside the box, it is deeper than you know. Hey, everyone! I need your help! Shipwreck was pulled from shelf after, after three days. The game received many complaints after its launch. This was Cogware's second last game. So what do you say, buddy? Let's go rescue the gang. Let's go rescue the gang. You know, skip. Skip. <laughs> yeah, even if it was if it was legit a children's game, like why does the rabbit have no arms? What's the easy way to do this? Um, just like lose a mini game. Volume is kind of low. Uh, I want to get slapped like that. Yeah. Huh? That's a bit loud now, maybe. Get to the button. Can you get there? It opened up a YouTube video. <laughs> it opened my browser. <laughs> Should I just do I link it or <laughs> I don't I didn't get to this in my initial playthrough. <laughs> Let me get it on the screen. Here is what it linked to. Why, why did they have the creepy music? No, that's it. Crazy. 
Thank you, Walter. Very cool. Did you guys see the people in the water when it went dark? Excuse me? See if there's anything else. Can we get to the boat? No. Maybe not. Okay, let's just press the first one. Now it should start doing the thing. Is it the one with the hooks? Yes. Get under here somehow. And the wall comes back. Oh, what the fuck? I never saw that the first time. Huh? <laughs> it wasn't there before. I see it again. Maybe that's what they meant. I thought maybe like underwater. You could see something if you went out of bounds or something. Yeah, they're not appearing anymore. Those hooks are sharp, huh? Alright, uh... One more to fail? Can I just fail the theater one? Or should I do a different one? I also never really did the the stuff in the extra area with the coat. In the in the area where you get the parts. This game is definitely one of my surprise horror games that I really, really liked. <laughs> it's probably my favorite horror game of the year so far. Aww. 
What to do? Oh, it's only seven. Another one. When should the movie start playing, Daryl? Which way is when you fail, Goose Dude? Who's the Who's the Goose? Again? What game is that? The Beaver is here. Oh, the chef guy. Okay, okay. Well, time to just go in there, I guess. Oh, that's why we get the freaking jump scare, too. Haha! <laughs> lowering the volume a little bit. Time to feed my Snorlax. Waha! Damn, it was fast this time. Can't talk to him. Oh! Uh. <laughs> Spook me. Even though I knew it was coming. There's a freaking comment writer. Okay. One more time. Then it'll be time. Damn! It's even impossible to, to beat it at this point. What is it even supposed to be? Uh. Uh. Everyone's gone to sleep. Oh! Yo, yo, how goes it, Beaverino? Look, I'm in quite the sea pickle here. I've been trying to activate my new radical mech. Mechanism. But I got them butterfingers. And I lost all my trinkets. I need to turn it on. If you could grab them all, that'd be radical. Alright, and watch out for the wretched. He's quite a creepy creeper. Friend, I've never been less excited to go somewhere. I know that video. 
What the fuck? Is this it? Oh my god, it's this- is it the same room? <laughs> the door is open. Is this a fucking reference to, uh... Oh, what is it called? Yes, that's Garten of Bonbon. What the fuck? Why? I just put the thing in the... Man, this sucks. Cow fingers. I've got no words. I hope you know a grown man wrote this, right? An adult wrote this. Someone who was old enough to drive wrote this. God damn it, man. It opened up Twitter. See? Is Donkey Dolphin? <laughs> here? Oh, I remember, wasn't it a meme for a while? Like, this guy was in the beta or something, and then he was removed. So now he's like, yo, he's back! Oh my god, I quit Garth and a Ben Ben out of frustration. No way! No! It opened a link to the scary maze game right at the end where the screamer is. It's cold. Oh, the is on his Twitter. Okay, wait. I already closed the site. Oh, never mind. I got it. The code for the door. Okay, the pinned tweet. The code for the door is seven two eight six. By the way. When's the bird gonna show up? No, bitch! Oh, I'm already here. Lore. It looks like all a lore relevant note. Yo, what's good? It's the wretched. I'm on holiday. This island sucks. We're taking a vacation. Fuck you, Duncan. It says trinket room. You doing keyboard? You mean like playing with a keyboard? Yes. It's fine. <laughs> Friend? This doesn't even look like an island anymore. But it's probably more immersive if you play with a controller. <laughs> I recognize this place. It's just an older location. Why is it here? Not a single trinket in sight. 
What even is a trinket? Hmm. A beating heart. Uh, oh. The fuck am I playing? Oh. oh I'm in the title screen. It was right outside a park, a statue put together using chunks of wood and cloth. It looked bizarre, but then I saw it move. Wait, is this the same? Oh, it's you. It's me! I thought I was the only one rotting down here. <laughs> so much has happened. So much. It beats the game for you? They call beyond your understanding. They call out to me. All four of them. Oh my I god. I their voices skittering around in the inside. I'm looking at the street. It's also down. making fun of uh, Bendy and the Ink Machine. <laughs> I need you to find me. It won't be easy to catch. You'll need to prove to me that you want what I have. If you do as I ask, Ow. you'll know Bruh. everything. Every single detail of what happened. Why you are who you are. What do you say? Should I have gone up? Let's On the elevator? Oh, it's just a final area! Probably chaos, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much for the bits. I mean, there's no reason for me to do this again, right? I feel like the bird's louder. Ha ha ha! Oh, seen, seen much of the joke is beyond Unity cheat console stuff. Uh huh. Maybe because my brain was already fried at this point. Don't remember the music being like this. Don't you be enemies? Fuck, where the fuck are these bitches? <laughs> can I set you be here? Yes, I can. Oh, here it is. Scariest shit I've ever seen. Oh, wait, can you. It would be nice if you could go in here again. No, you can't. <laughs> Oh, it was materializing. It never pissed him off. Oh. Ah! Oh shit, that was loud.
It would have been a nice Easter egg, I guess. Decade space 66 free. Oh my god, it's so loud! Oh, I can't pause the game. Uh, no, man, thank you so much for the 14 months! That won't be happy. I'd love to change the volume, but I'm kind of stuck. Okay, I can lower the volume now. reason for me to do this, I already beat the game. I just wanted to see the easter egg. <laughs> I can't even leave. Disobey you. Just kill me. I'm stuck here forever. was fun. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you. Sonic rules one, two, three, four. Thank you so much for subscribing. Welcome to the Bamboozlers. My poor ears. I'm so sorry. I had the game. At like 30% volume, 20%? Like super low. But loud is scary for horror games, I guess. I'm back what I miss. Uh, I played, uh... <laughs> I played a little bit of the update for Shipwrecked 64, which added a new area. And it made fun of Garten of Bun Bun. Has the developer for that game ever came for come forward with everything? <laughs> you know, she just put, makes the games and then posts them on Steam and then nothing else. The second voice is telling you to open the maps known as Labs and Layer 1 empty using the console command. I'm not sure if there's a way in the game itself to get set console commands, but using an external tool, you can actually enable it and open those maps. Oh, so there's not even... a way for me to do that in-game. That's very much just something that I will watch on YouTube. <laughs> it actually needs a Unity console? Fuck. Oh, cool! Uh, 
Um, I now have um a barbo time. I have a bunch of other ones. So there's this uh there's this creepy pasta story called like no players okay. online. That's also on Steam. Oh no, it's not it's not on Steam yet. Is it a demo pr prototype? Yeah, so they made a new one. It's been uploaded in like the last 30 days. Because the original was from like 2019. Uh... A VHS tape titled Capture the Flag Project appears on the player's desktop. Clicking on the game. Mm -hmm. It's like a story how it's a... It was an online game, but there's no players online because it's old. So it's, it's about someone who just decides to explore the map. And how weird multiplayer levels feel when there's no actual players. But then you find something, of course... So that's that's kind of the story, I guess. <laughs> so I got a I got a bunch of short games, and Barboteen was the one I already kind of saw a playthrough of it on YouTube, so I know what happens. It's just about like a person who gets infected with something, and uh, and weird stuff happens. <laughs> <laughs> I lived that scenario. Really? I'll, I'll play the... Oh, if I try to open it, Windows protected your PC. <laughs> Running this app might put your PC at risk. Oh. Does it have any... Is it like a fourth wall breaking game? Does it take any data? <laughs> Interesting. Oh, yeah. Apparently, WACTAC.BML is a machine learning virus detector, so it could be a false positive. Windows Defender flags your game as a virus. <laughs> just, I was just wondering if other people read into it. Wagtag? I don't know what that is. I'm sure it's totally safe. <laughs> I should run it. <laughs> Or it just I, there's no option. It just says don't run. Oh, run anyway. Don't run. No players online. It's not showing up, OBS. Oh, there it is.
I captured the flag. A game pie. Thibaut van den Broek. Yeah, it's like it's totally different. I guess I just really liked the concept and made something else. What the fuck? Is a virus. No players online. Who knows? Maybe we'll find someone. Yeah. Doxed. My name, John Mullard. Oh, I don't know that one. Log in as a guest, I guess. John Mullard of Alores? <laughs> uh. Very functioning. Mines is 20. Okay. Nothing here. <laughs> We're connecting to the internet, everybody. <laughs> Sorry, my stream is lagging. My internet is kind of slow. Thank you for the hydrates. I will get some new some new drink in a bit. Okay, okay. We're gonna watch my stream. I oh, mean, what the fuck? Why not? Game design board. Oh, it's like... Oh. What's going on here? It's... It's, uh... Was you originally like this too? I thought that was more of a map that you would be exploring. But this is an actual kind of like detective ARG kind of game. Yeah, the original is just a map. Okay. Today's news, oh. Ah, fuck! Just this... Just this website works. Maybe I need to download the game from here. Fishing with knives too. Hell yeah! Maybe it downloads the file to the folder. Alright. It's very extreme. Don't care, didn't ask. I 
How do I go back? Okay. New release. 20 summer days. Hell yeah. Finally a dating sim on this website. Can't wait to play it. Alright. Exploring the rest of this website for a bit. Oh. Never mind. Damn. Okay. Let's play fishing and knives. This one. I like the animations. It's a nice looking computer UI. How to play. Can't believe you opened this. It's a simple game. Just play it. Wow. Okay, Brett. Man. Bitch. Oh. Let's fucking go! Dave the Diver who? Fuck, I drown. Is this what people did in the 90s? Yo! Now I'm busy, bro. Did you see the IHOP exclusive Sonic DLC? What? I gotta go up. Get some air. Need to get a hundred. Bye. Yeah. Can I get damage? Yo, there was a big fish in the back. Okay, okay. Let's uh, get this. Yeah. More damage. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep playing this the entire stream. See that friend request. How do I go there? The chat? Ah, oh, thank you! Astray, what's up? Thank you so much for the raid! How are you? Thanks for accepting my friend request. Hey, you're welcome. Oh, it doesn't matter what I type. It just automatically times something else. <laughs> Are you playing content warning? How is it? I want to play with people. It's funny. <laughs> I'm Quinn. I saw you online and before I've been decided to add you. I wanted to play a game with you. Want to play a game? I am playing a, a game called... Curve. I'm playing a game called... Uh... What is this called? <laughs> no players online. No players online. And uh, we're probably gonna play a game where there's no one online. 
Okay. That sounds creepy. Not in a creepy way. Just like I I don't really have any online friends. Okay, no worries, bro. Anyway, I hope your stream went well. If you need to rest or eat something, be sure to do so. I need to take a break so I can take my meat out of the fridge or, or like out of the freezer. I used to mean, but they haven't been online for a long time, so I haven't been looking for. So I've been looking for new online friends. Okay, so what game do you want to play? You want to play uh, Fish and Knives? I found this website with an alpha test for some shooter game. I'm pretty sure they stopped development on the game, but... In a sexy way. <laughs> the download link is still up so you can play it. So it's just a simple shooter game. Are you asking so many questions, bro? No, no, no. It's like a capture the flag game. But I don't really care about the flags. I play for the kills. You're one of those people who doesn't play objectives. Send me the link! Yeah! Alright. Come on, internet. Ugh, all right. That's how I felt about Warhammer 40k tabletop. Can't do anything else in the meantime. Create a room. Be back with your room. Set room size for set map. Gorge. Start. All right, everybody, if anyone wants to join, there's no password, so you can just find the map. Do I need to tell the guy? Seems I can't leave. Your room is kind of stinky. It's just an online room. You have the flag. Okay. I just bring it back. Come on, bro. Join. He wants to play, but... Like, you just care about kills. You're gonna play then. It's a 1v1. Why is it so dark? Wait, I'm lost. I am John Mullard. Trying to get back into my own account. To shoot somebody. This is where I got the flag from. 
opportunity to join my game? It is pretty nice, like the little pink blobby effect. I like that. It was here, it was just so dark. Oh, he joined! So there is a player online. Where's your music now? Oh, it kind of looked like... I thought it was kind of a skull or something from far away. I Edery, thank you for being here. Hi there. Oh! Did you guys see that? There was something... standing. That was me, sorry. Oh! Bitch, I can't see. Yo, bro! Play the game! This is too easy! There's like text that appears sometimes. Wait! Oh, I couldn't shoot it. Oh, only 20 seconds. Come on, come on, come on! Even though I'm my head. It's probably fine. Just wanna get the extra point, you know? Let's go, let's go! Five! Oh! Fuck you! I ran out of memory. The development of the game has been temporarily suspended due to a personal bereavement affecting our team. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Sentimental. I think my computer is broken. I think there's something wrong with my graphics card. <laughs> it's got a blue screen. <laughs> yep. <laughs> That's so funny. Your graphics card needs an exorcism? Uh, it's starting over? The 
Did this happen before? Oh, I can't select a guest anymore. But I don't know the password! Was I supposed to find that out? Send... Send men? Sentimental. It's just sentimental. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Send men! <laughs> wow! Got my account back! Let's go! I like this. Yeah, it takes from my actual clock. It's currently 1993. Soul transfer? Any music on this? Can I drag an audio file into this? That'd be pretty funny. Did it crash? No, I alt tap to look for an audio file. <laughs> to see if I could play something. Uh... Let's see... Mm. No, it doesn't allow you. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, so oh, this guy's the developer. Is this also the fish game? Oh, let's try the summer day, so you can try that. I don't know if I can copy. Yeah! A visual novel, 2nd of August 1989. Kyung Lee University. Wasn't that the school day's visual novel? Yeah, totally! Ugh. Why did I think it was a good idea to sign up for the summer program? My name is Park Sung Lee, 23 years old. I'm a master student in the true sense of the word. I can't remember the last time I didn't have to attend some, some lecture or study for some exam. And even though it's summer, I find myself once again in a classroom. Next summer, I should just focus on myself. Spend some quality time doing nothing for a change. Oh wait, I forgot to write my thesis next year. Okay, those are worries for later. Let's try to sit through this class first. I 
think this guy is dozing off. We're gonna find something here. Mr. Song is going over the same chapter we did last week. Okay, guys, I'm gonna take a small break to uh, take to take my meat out and get a snack and a drink and stuff. I will be right back.
Hello. Cheers, bro. I got a... So I ordered some... Pepsi Max on Amazon and it was delivered just now. And they... I, I ordered a bunch because I was like, well... That saves me from having to buy it for a long time. And they put every package in a separate box. They could have just thrown it into one big box, but they didn't do that. <laughs> anyway, I got Pepsi. <laughs> and my cat has food. Hey. Uh, see, there you go. I also have a cup of tea. Man, this visual novel sucks. Sucks monkey fuck. Can you blame him? Looks like it's pretty misty out. It'll probably rain later. Guess it's still the season. Okay, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> I'm so sleepy. I shouldn't have gotten that dorm room. So it's so loud there at night. At least it's nice and quiet here. Maybe I can just close my eyes for a little bit. Wake up, sleepyhead. Oh my god, a girl! I think your class ended an hour ago, silly. Shoot, did I just sleep through the whole class? Well, I don't know about you, but I'm heading out. If you like to hang around in empty classrooms, that's your business. Who is that? I don't think she's in my class. She's kind of... cute. Anyways, I should head out before it starts raining. Kyung Lee Univers University entrance. The cicadas drown out the sound of the road behind you. Stepping out from the air-conditioned building, you are hit with the sweltering humidi humidity. Is there any... <laughs> Do I have to play through this or is this just a game in a game? <laughs> We're gonna close it. Okay, normal. Sarah. What do these have to do with Sarah? Downloading my own uh, game. I won't open it just yet. See what else is on here. Isn't this the guy that, like, edited us? Wanted to say I really like the alpha test of the game. Glad to hear it. If you discover any bugs, feel free to let me know. Can't wait for the official. Oh. That seems nice enough. Winston. Oh, this guy was also on the game... game website... board thing. Hey, John. It's Winston H. Richmond from howtowinston.richmond.org. <laughs> I played your game and I'm beyond impressed. 
and his engine is miles ahead of its competition. 3D graphics. I mean, wow. Just wow. Let's sit down sometime in the future and start and talk about working together. I'm available Friday. I'm available this Friday. I'm also available this Friday. Hey, John. Just check back in with you. Maybe you missed my last message. Would love to hear. Would love to talk about what we can do for each other. Hey, John, I'll be out of the office for foreseeable for the foreseeable future. Some government issues. Don't worry about it. So just some government issues. For some reason, they're convinced I'm evading taxes. <laughs> yeah, John Depp. Sentimental? Nope. Wait, is this our game? Eight. Go! Join my game, guys! Password is Yuria123. Oh, this is so developed. There's voices. Infinite ammo still. Hold up, I gotta update my game first. No worries, no worries, I can wait. Just, uh, there's a limit of eight people, so... Be pretty quick. Do you have a link for the game so we can join? Uh... Yeah, I'll send you down the link. <laughs> Corinne is playing with the toy, so cute. Crouch. Very close to the game, too. It's pretty bad map design, right? Like, no way. Huh? No, you're just a target there. There's like no way... No reason to be there. Okay, so how do I get out of here in-game? Maybe I can go there. I can't pick him up. It just doesn't work. The other one you could uh, play solo, technically. But here... 
here just says waiting for players. The boy. Probably not. It's not actually online, right? No, I would like to play this with people. If it would work, it would just be fun. Maybe there is something like out of bounds. I think I just fell through the map. Ow! Can I clo- Oh, okay, okay, I can close it, actually. By instinct, I was just gonna alt F4, but that probably closes the whole thing. <laughs> Why does it work like that? Oh no! Wah 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 wah. What the fuck is this? Soul transfer. game today that behaved unlike anything I've seen before. The gameplay was much more abstract than usual. Hmm. How do I get in something into this? So this is the same game, but a different version? Yep. Ah! Oh, it just crashes. Okay, this time it just doesn't do anything. I think we have to play this? You're no patches? What do you mean? I don't think it'll do better than Counter-Strike. Do I have to play this? I'm scared something is gonna jump out. Don't worry about it. Mines is 20? It's just how many mines? 
at jumping, more variety. These are the games. this how does this work so how can i put something in here do i have to act, drag actual files in here oh i can what drag a picture. Let's try it. What about infuse? There, a picture that was kind of similar. So, what about this one and this one? No, a picture of a person, but there's been no pictures of a person. This is just like a... And I'll drag these. What if I... Do the beta... And the one that's in the downloads, maybe? Because it's the same game, right? Packages. Thank you for downloading the alpha version. Manifest. Okay, that just creates the pod. At this point, I'm just putting random shit together. Mm. To do... Fix geometry, schedule a meeting...
I'm gonna see if I can find something on the itch.io page. Someone said, look for frames. Is it this? Oh. Yeah, okay, but what do I put in here? The icon looks about the same. Pictures? Oh, thank you! Thank you! Slugler of Cats! Thank you so much for using your Prime Sub! Let's fucking go! Really appreciate it, man. Nice looking room. Do I have to drag this? Nice audio files, bro. Can't play him. So can I put this in here too? No, it's only this one. Okay. Let me... Oh, let's just read it. Generate host, add two games as sources. Press transfer soul. If enough games have similar souls, they will be combined. Okay, so I probably have to infuse stuff together first. Yeah, it's, it's very much like this picture matches that. Place the vessel game into the middle slot. Place a fitting stone in the correct slot. Press infuse. Soul essence from the stone will be infused into the vessel game. Opening the game immediately will allow the souls to do whatever they want with it. It's best to open the game through the editor and implement mechanics manually. Require sigils.star inserted at port 01 with pentastar version 03 or higher. Buying game crashes immediately. Find a way to transfer graphical assets. 
If it only worked like that, this is magic. We put like Pokemon and Elder Ring together. Okay, so I just gotta drag the games in there. So this this one? No? But like, this one and this one are similar enough. But it won't work. In the game dev sim, I could never do it. <laughs> dragging like most of it in there probably don't have to actually play it right more Diaper if it was good. Hell yeah. I like the music though. Okay, let's get on your uh Weapon. Oh, there was a big fish. Trying not to die for once. Die! Well, I figure it's out. Eaten by the big fish. <gasps> okay, okay, okay. Let's get ourselves uh, another better weapon. Yeah. Burn, fish, burn! Yeah! Many in a row. Just one more. Yeah. Yeah, go fish. Get kill. Mega combo. I didn't even give a lot of points. I 
How much was that one weapon upgrade? <laughs> Yo! Oh, 500. What we got now? Easy thousand! Yo, dark! I will not say it. I will not. Yo! Got a fucking sword. Why is the the vision going weird? Maybe we've been playing the game for too long. The game is the, the, the game inside of the game is warning us. Stop playing. You gotta infuse souls. You gotta infuse softwares together. You can't even damage me. Let's go, go as deep as we can. Sure, if I'll be able to make it up now. We gotta commit now. Or we are just at the bottom. There's nothing more. Fuck, <laughs> right there's a big fish. Yeah, I was just there. <laughs> well, let's get the final weapon then. Maybe the boss will show up if we get it. The sharks were just hanging out with me. Okay, 1500? 1600. Oh. This doesn't even look cooler. I think I beat it. There's nothing else I can unlock. Let's leave. Leave this place. That's a fish. Edit this. Okay, wait. 
look up this game and everything I find about it is like the uh is the old one They work, yeah. There's nothing I can I can find anything. mobile but I already put like everything like do I I guess put every random combination here fish game and visual novel okay these work Put this here now? The minesweeper? Meow! Can I open this? <laughs> meow! Come in! You meowed while there was an in-game dog barking. That was, uh, that was weird. Corin, what's up? Could you guys hear it? <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, are you gonna be on the desk again? Uh... What are you doing? Okay, you moved. Do you just want pets? You just want attention. I haven't been playing with you, right? I'm sorry, buddy. Yeah. Gonna show Chad your butt? As cats do? You're gonna sit down over there, please. Okay, I guess I'll just play while... I cannot read chat because... He's like right in, sitting right in front of it. Nina wants to go out. Should I take her? It's okay. I can take her for you. Let me just finish up this part real quick. 
No, please. I've been bothering you enough all day. I'll take her again. I don't mind. But it's night out right now. Really not safe. I'll just go around the park. I will be fine. Corrine, why are you like this? Why are you like this? I give you scratches, yeah. Love you too. Take Nina out for a walk, yes. Oh wait, this was like oh no, it's very similar to that photo. It's darker out than I thought. Should that uh, should be okay. What's wrong, Nina? You see something? <laughs> Come in. <laughs> Can I reach out? What's something saying? Um. Your nose is wet. You got a snotty nose. You're having trouble seeing where you're going. Keep going, yes. <sighs> what I've been enjoying about the weather change is at least staying like uh it's the the sun is out longer. It always used to get dark around like 4 p.m. You still you hear the still water of the lake. Sorry, my cat's head is like right in fucking front of the monitor. He's very upset that I'm taking this in-game dog for a walk, and not him. <laughs> Here, wait, I took a photo. It's you! That's you! You are on the computer and you are actually in front of the computer. <laughs> Look! <laughs> I can't have shit. <laughs> Ow. Sorry. He bit me. For petting him. Keep going, yes. Alright. There we go. Less noise. Okay. I'll remove you now so I can continue the game. You decide to keep going. Did the dog die? Is the EXE still there? No, it's just gone. Okay, uh... Fish game? Where did I put it? Mine friend and fish game. But I can't see half of the screen because of this fucking cat. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, there's something new. Oh, this is, this is the stone. Oh. Okay, it's time to move. Get out of the way, fucking fat ass. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> he moved. <laughs> Alright, let's see. So I'll move the game over a little bit. Would that make more sense if I moved it like here? And then I move here. Oh wait, I mixed it with the fishing game. So now there's fish. <laughs> Wait, so I mixed the fishing... Wait, the... The visual novel and the fishing game? Right? Oh! A thick sheet of glass is separating the player and the fish. Looking in their eyes, you sense a sign of relief. Huh, that's kind of cool. The player remembers music. This isn't what they were expecting. If I'm being honest, I'd like some music. I didn't do this, of course. There's three of us here now. Well, four, counting you. At least we're up here. The concrete walls are filled with renewed ambience. A pool of water bridges an unfriendly gap. Feelings of sitting at the lake with friends stir up inside you. Still, you can't ignore the other watching from across the lake. The other? Ah! Blech. At last, the player reaches the blue base. The flag awaits them. Oh. Oh no, this is all wrong. I have to talk with the other one. He's hard to talk to. What the fuck? <laughs> die, fish, die! Can I still... Yeah. Ayo. Let's go out of bounds. I'll probably fall through the map again. Now there's water here. Oh, never mind. Oh. I don't respawn this time. Oh! What the fuck is that? Oh, maybe 
Maybe I was meant to do this. There is a face. And when I saw her face, now I'm a believer. Yeah, there's nothing else here. I'm not sure if I can shoot it. It doesn't seem to do much. It's just swimming around. It looks like the pot of greed. <laughs> Dodges. I don't know where I'm going. Over there, I think. Oh, I don't think I can even get to it. Just keep on swimming. Box go all over here. What the heck? The player stands in a room with a wooden door, a clock ticking, a carpet with a familiar smell. Grassy lawns circled by concrete pillars seem only a distant memory now. Open the door? Yes? Where else are we gonna go? Resident Evil ass transition. <laughs> oh, let's go upstairs. Oh, what the heck? The game is uh, bugging out with everybody. <laughs> Bitch, I can't see. Bitch, snap out of it. Bitch, I can't fucking see. Can I do anything here? Oh my cat pooped, it smelled so bad! <laughs> uh, I hope it's not on the freaking wall again, at least. Oh, let me close the door. Stinky. Stinky. Where the fuck am I supposed to go? Again from the other side. It's only one way. Fall through the map again somewhere.
Uh, something interactable. Sounds like you hit a Minecraft villager. What? Trying to uh, maybe look up. I look up a playthrough and there's just someone. It's like, oh, I beat the game. It's just like the guest part. It didn't even log into the second account. This is what they mean. Look for the frames. These? But what can I do with them? Oh! It's not finished yet, of course. I see what you're saying. It's not that I don't agree with you, it's just the process, you know? when you come in about my work before it's done. How would you feel if I did that with yours? I mean, you can give me feedback when I'm working on it. That's okay. Oh, okay. No, it's okay, really. Don't worry. I have stuff I have to do downstairs. You can have the room. I just don't want to talk about this right now. Just stop helping me for the rest of the day. I love you too, honey. I'll see you later. <gasps> oh, another room! Maybe upstairs? Yeah, okay, okay. You really cut it like that? It's weird, I never noticed. Hmm... Is it weird that sometimes you feel like a new person to me? Don't look at me like that. I meant in a good way. I'm sorry. I added some cold water so you can drink it right away. Thank you. I'll have some tea. Mm, it's kind of too cold now. I don't like it. Are you sure? I can run out and get some. Get some. It's fine. Really? Thank you so much. I'll just let it simmer then for now. Welcome. Fuck a spammer. Silver Wolf, thank you for following. 
Can we talk about it tomorrow? I'll have to get really up, up early tomorrow. Yeah, I'm meeting with my agent again. Oh, you know, she wanted to go over the details with the retrospective. I'm just saying that I want you to be able to do your thing. And I worry about you spending so much time taking care of me. It's just... I don't want to be responsible for you giving... Giving everything up. <laughs> giving everything up. Reading is hard. I can't really understand what you're doing, you know? I don't know how to help you. And you don't have to help me. I have her for that. How can we be married if you're upstairs and I'm downstairs all the time? Is this just going to be like some tragic story about like... I don't know, a divorce? <laughs> Is anything I'm saying... Oh. How word does work, exactly. If you're keeping me downstairs, what's the point? You didn't even make me make the second floor. You didn't even need to be so transparent. Why can't you still? Oh, if you find me, what are you expecting? Why are you keeping me in here? Where do you work? What is this place? What is this? Okay. So this, that's like that Sarah, right? Yo, can we get some unregistered hypercam going? <laughs> exactly. Is this marriage marriage counseling now? Cut my life into pieces. This is my last reason. The bit rate is kill. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's just what. Oh, this is the part where we lost a dog. Is my model bit right also fucked? Guess I'll walk to the blue square again. Is it back to normal? Oh, no, it's not. The is... is just... I can't read that. I will... I will look... I look within. Model's fine? Okay. Yeah, this is just how the game looks. Oh, uh, crashed. Oh, it's a fucking demo! Ow! Ooh. Okay. Happy Halloween, Yuria. Thank you. Uh... Well, it was really cool. I finally figured figured it out at the end. Oh my Bitch, I can't see. Bitch, snap out of it. Bitch, I can't fucking see. Yeah, it's it's a uh, it's nice. I will add it to my wish list. The original game is just 
Like you walk through that map and... Ooh. Spooky! There's a ghost! Right? It's like, oh, one player comes online and it's, oh, it's a ghost! A scary face, dude. Neat? Uh, so I have some more games. I have a game called Bunny Farm. I have the Barber Teen game. Milo.exe Who wants to be a murderer like a TV show? Who is Milo? It's like a dog. I think. Is that a category in Twitch? Milo. There are multiple... Milo's castle. Isn't that a thing? Milk inside of a bag of milk? I don't know if it's just called Milo, if that's it. Should I just play ga games and demos? Oh, wait, let me move the screen. It's getting dark. I better come back tomorrow to continue looking for Milo. I had to follow the sunlight to get back to my car. Okay. I would not stop looking. It's pretty fucking misty around here. Oh my god. Milo? <laughs> He's just a PNG. Okay. <laughs> Dude, someone just took a shit out of my pants. <laughs> I had my volume pretty low. <laughs> uh, how do I escape it? Oh, here's the lore. You went on a vacation trip to a cabin with your family and your dog Milo. When you arrived at your destination, you noticed that he was behaving strangely. He was aggressive. Sometimes he didn't recognize you. He didn't eat and still vomited a lot. While you sleep, you are awakened by a strange noise and discovered that Milo escaped into the forest. Bye. Milo? Freaking smile dog looking ass. Let's go this way then. Can I go into the forest? 
Like, what's the goal? Ow. No. What the fuck? Okay, no more Milo, that exe. Bruh. Well, this guy won a competition. Winning game of the King Samuel Developer Competition. You want a thousand bucks to create this game. How do you win it? How do you beat it? I was just like some guy. I guess you can run away. Open the stream. Saw the thingy. Eyes got hurt. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, never mind. We're not playing this. Um, actually, let's just play the bar 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 team. This should be a category. Barbell. Yeah. <clears throat> there we go. Maybe you win by not playing. Oh my god, maybe you're right. We're playing a lot of PS1 style horror games today, so four by three. Yo, PS1 or PSX. Pizza party. Oh. A great time, it seems. Hey man, can you grab me a beer? Okay. Everybody... They're blocking the way to the kitchen. Oh. Have you been? What's that sound? I'm gonna lower it. Is that part of the game? Uh. Do you think she's okay? <laughs> hey yo, I got you a beer. Thanks, man. <laughs> 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 
It's uh, it's by Riz, yes. Is this my room? Got ourselves some white bread. We definitely need to throw out the trash. Yeah, drink some water. Uh. Just drink. Go back to our room. Nice jammy, thank you. Matches my colors. Oh, hell yeah, we're gonna play some PlayStation and... Oh. Yo, what's happening with my skin? Ew, the pet's all nasty too. Yeah, we definitely have seen better days. Three days of no bath. Don't worry about it. Just grab some water again? No. Grab yourself some Heinz beans. I recognize... I recognize... Recognize those designs. Oh, sure. Let's go into the hacking basement. And, uh... Yes. <laughs> What did we even do? It definitely looks like Les Plagas. Maybe this is just a Resident Evil for other... Oh, I wanted to see what we look like. Oh, never mind. The mirror is here now. Different uh, perspective kind of thing. You live like this? Yes, what about it? This is where I stream? Got everything I need. Damn. The trash is piling up too, but the fruit still be looking fresh. Uh... Can I not go? There he is! There he is! Just... I don't know, doesn't seem that bad of a guy. Oh. They, they're like marble statues with flowers on their head. Oh, they're here now. They're hanging out. We're having, we're having a party. Maybe it's like Saya no Uda, where, where this is what I see, but they're actually, in their eyes, it's normal. And they're like, yo, why are you acting so weird? Where the fuck am I? Okay. Supposed to go. All right, we're gonna dig again. Day five. A wonderful, beautiful day, yo. Time to pop some zits. What the fuck is this room? Is this still my? 
my room? Where did the PlayStation go? Oh, it's still here. It's normal. It's the only normal thing here. <laughs> the TV and the PlayStation. Right? Surviving this well, it's incredible. Alright, well... Uh... You know, shit happens. Literally. This could happen to any, any of us. Ow. Why? Time to go back to the basement. What are we digging for now? Oh, green person. Green is my favorite color. Real, actually. Hey. You know you can't do that until you look at yourself. Oh. Okay. You gotta go to the bathroom? Like... If I only walked a little bit faster. I don't like looking at myself in the mirror. Already looking at myself all the time on the OBS preview. I look at my face enough. When I don't have to, I take those. Green is a nice color. Yes! It reminds me of nature. And bamboo. Which is a product of nature, I'd say. So... Green is not a creative color. I don't care. I love it. Where, where the fuck do I look at myself, then? Oh. Get ready, they're coming for you. Right-click stun when vulnerable, then attack. Oh. Yeah, alright, that's what I look like. Oh, what the fuck? Did not expect that. It's combat time. Fucking ready to murder you guys. Let's go! Tired of this shit. It's so random. Uh. Uh, I guess you could say that's uh, my uh, dick, yeah. <laughs> Where's the door? here. Yeah! The combat's kind of interesting. It looks like a cat wants that tracks. What do you mean? Yeah, I know they have like barbed dicks, so whenever. 
Whenever they, whenever cats mate, like it hurts really bad for the female. Motherfucker. to the place now. How do I get there? I have a sip. <clears throat> Most large... <laughs> large lizards and significant amount of venomous snakes also have barbs slash hooks on their armies. <laughs> it's so that the female won't escape. Yo, the PlayStation! Died while gaming. <clears throat> A true hero among us. Motherfucker. It's a bit busy. Oh my god. Ah, oh, it's too many. Oh. My dick's too small. It doesn't reach them. <laughs> Gotta slap him a yellow. Yeah, 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 I know, I know. But the it's really short. Is when you can do that. Oh. Yo! Oh my god. Ow! <laughs> I just get hit by another one. <clears throat> okay, let me chuck my tea real quick. One by one. Come this way, bro. Yeah. Oh, come on. Too far away. Oh, the rage is so short, man. 
Oh no, I start over. Yeah, definitely. Um, I'm sure th sure there's like pills or something I can take. <laughs> But it's like, it doesn't get him. What the fuck? Why not? Oh, come on. Ah, I hit him when he's yellow, I swear. I hit him like before. Health? go to the TV immediately. Oh! Motherfucker! Why? Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna die, but... <laughs> it bucked out. <laughs> Die here too? Yes. I like the music. <laughs> I guess you just have to go through all of them until they're all dead. Ah, oh, come on, I hit him. like yellow it, 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 it doesn't it doesn't do anything <laughs> uh. more tips <laughs> you turn around and then he turned yellow. So I hit him, but then afterwards I couldn't attack.
Well, at least the game's free. Okay. A smooth one for once. Is there more? I hear more. Oh, he coming. Yeah. The overhead timing is weird. Is there more? I think this is it here. No way, it's the overhead that, that's really wonky. to do it later when it's the overhead because it turns yellow but that doesn't seem to do anything And if you just moved, then it doesn't allow you to attack again. So you are kind of screwed when there's many. Or you can also go here. Oh my god. Just like a teleport. Where? Where? Interesting, interesting. Doop, 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 doop. Oh, look, it's my spine. Maybe I was one of them all along. Holy hello. I'm like behind me? Oh, there you go. The fucking overhead again. Ah! No! Ah! More this. What a pain. Where 
did so well. I think I just have to be a little slower. Slower with pressing the button. Yep. It's not Liza P, Yuria. Oh, I got it wrong anyway. Oh, and now I get cornered, so... Ah! Motherfucker. <laughs> Through the wall. Okay, wait, give me a second. Barboteen. This game is also... Oh, this game is also in Steam. But it's free on itch. Sorry, I was gonna look there. The, I like the description. Explore your progressively distorting apartment across seven levels and indulge in increasingly uncanny atmosphere. Engage intense combat. Dig a hole. Okay, see how different this is then? Oh, no, let's stay here. Ah, uh, okay, I just got more lives now. I couldn't hit him. Oh, fucking hell. Ah, oh, he pushed me off. <laughs> oh. Get more lives and still die. Everyone was on me immediately. Kill fifteen. This is a very Yuria core game, though. <laughs> like, oh, this is a game for Yuria because she plays weird horror games. It's like, oh, whenever I go to your channel, you're always playing some weird shit. 
It's really easy. It, you can just browse like the itch.io page. Sort by horror. And uh, just download a bunch of what is whatever the fuck is available. And sometimes it's good, and other times it's really, really bad. Like Milo.exe. I guess just also following a bunch of YouTubers who also play weird stuff. I think it's fun to... I don't know, whenever someone uploads one of these or like I, I add them to my wishlist and they end up pretty sure. It's like, yeah, might as well just play like a bunch of them. Oh, here's the last one. Okay. The basement. Time to dig another hole. Please don't fall in the hole. I don't want to play it again. <laughs> hey, Gumi. Everything's back to normal. Oh, thank you. Don't please... Can you not go onto the desk, please? No. Gumi. I was like holding him back and he just steps over my arm. Like, no, I will sit here if I want to. Move! Fat ass! There you go. <gasps> We're normal! Quotation mark normal. Oh, it's not. It's just a computer room. Yay! Okay, oh okay, that's it. Yay! Well, all right, we dug a hole. Did we just close the game? And that's it. Wonder forever in our apartment on a loop. <gasps> Very interesting. Oh, well, that was neat. I liked it. All right, what is this game again? I think I can play one more. Oh, Bronny Farm, I downloaded. That was from like an ARG. Oh, it's so loud. Oh, it's so loud, it's so loud, it's so loud. Or no, 
no, no, it wasn't analog horror kind of thing. Bunny farm? It's not a category. I think we maybe watched it before? It's one of those games that you have to window capture. Gather around. What is it, Mr. B? Yeah, what is it, Bob? Oh, don't tell me you guys forgot about today. Any oh, oh, I know, I know. Ask me, please. I Remember? Know. Yeah, it was something Anyone similar about, like, outside? children but being murdered or something. Right, it's, like, guys. very vague. What day is it today? Yeah, the oh, Walton oh, Files. Oh, yeah. Oh, we do a huge party on the restaurant every year. Oh, I forgot about that. Oh, heavens, me too. Well, I'm sure this party is much better than last year's, right? Well, uh, I need all of you to... Man, it's kind of glitching out, huh? You guys love fruit, right? Uh, no. Oh, heavens, what are we gonna do? Oh no! Oh heavens, what are we gonna do? I like whatever is going on here in the background. Hell, I couldn't help but notice you guys need fruits real quick. My barn's filled with all kinds of fruits. Say, why don't you guys do me a small favor and I'll give you all the fruits you need. Yes! Barn adventure! I love barns! I wanna see the pigs and the chickens in the air. It sounds pretty authentic. Alright, Pete. Well, that'd be fun. All the best work can Really? What? What? Well, what do we for me? Yo, can someone fix up this uh, VHS? Pete the Hippo's farm. Fun fact, Benny loves birds. She loves to hear birds sing too. Do you like birds? Do you guys like birds? Oh wow, the game is so... High quality now. Bonds Burgers. Fun fact. Fun fact. <laughs> I I'm thought fine. it. Wait, shouldn't you be in the barn with the rest of the gang? Yeah, everything put there. I'm supposed to solve this party, but most of the stuff I need is located in the ridiculously complex puzzles. Say, could you help me out to solve the puzzles? Alright, first we need to get the party hats. They should be in the big. Alright. What try. the fuck? I think, uh, oh! That looks kind of creepy. I think we need to blow in a card rich for a bit. Yeah, this is a game! <laughs> Tell me we're just watching the video. No! They should be in the basement.
What? Ow, my ears. Scary. Wait, what? Oh no, there's a high chance that bunnyform.ppx pp data has been corrupted or information has been altered, replaced by a third party. We recommend you unplug the machine immediately. Opening the file may lead to unknown glitches and errors in the levels. If you want to continue, however, we warn you that the machine could suffer major major and even worst case a complete shutdown deleting all valuable information in it do you still wish to continue yes what could go wrong apples apples apples, apples. <laughs> what the fuck is this Apples. <laughs> Yay, Bonnie. Oh, X. I can't... I couldn't read it. <laughs> wow! Pretty horn place! Why, hello there! Wow! Pretty horse girl! I'm supposing you two... Wow, pretty horse girl! Yes, you stick my muscles. I want to feed them and take care of them and play with them and dance with them and ride with them and play with them. <laughs> All right. I need you to pay attention to what I say. And this bitch gay. Okay, so... <laughs> she just turns completely red. <laughs> open the cages, unless I tell you to. <laughs> she has those real crazy eyes going. Really, really funny. Yeah, I think I'm gonna open the cage now. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, look at those graphics. Those are supposed to be pigs. Oh no, Benny! What have you done? All the pigs have escaped to the hippo house. Benny, you dumb bunny. You I dumb bunny. Sorry. I was just trying to help. It looks like they each entered a different door. We'll have to find keys for each door. Alright, no problem. Let's do it. What the fuck is the meat gonna do? Oh! Oh, look at that! He's gonna eat it! Oh, we got the key now! Let's go! He's distracted. Isn't this like a FNAF fanfiction? Well, it's very much based off those mini games, right? So, where are these pigs? Where are these motherfucking pigs? I can't tell if I am moving around or not. I'm just going all the way up again. Am I moving? Oh my... <gasps> Bitch, I can't see! Bitch, snap out of it. Bitch, I can't fucking see! I think I'm stuck. 
Am I supposed to close this game? Like, it wouldn't surprise me if it's one of those things that's on... Oh, it's on purpose! You gotta restart and something will be different, right? Uh. Okay. No, I feel like I'm stuck. What the heck? <laughs> you could sue me if you... <laughs> there was nothing bad on screen, but you could just see like... Gay SSD and Yuria Gay SSD. I hope you guys like my hard drive names. <laughs> Why did it pick that? <laughs> oh, there's explorer.exe, bunnyfarm, or bunnyfarm.exe. <laughs> leaked. <laughs> and I leaked my folders. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what do I call this one? <laughs> uh, the game's not capturing anymore. What the heck? <laughs> Angela Dio used at permitted term big gay. Benoe farm? Let's try this again. We allow the big A here. <laughs> it's kind of a banger. Okay, does it work now? I was gonna start over. All right, gang, gather around. What is it, Mr. B? Oh hell no! It's yeah, just gonna Mr. start Bob. over. Oh, don't tell me you guys forgot. Okay, about well, yeah, I tried it. Any I don't want to. I want to. Don't want to play through it again. <laughs> It can't be that long. It's probably just that one level. Okay, I have one more game we could try, I guess. Um, extract here. Uh, VTube Studio is not allowing me to move. Why not? Why not? Okay, I guess we'll play this game here. Uh... It's not showing up? What Yuri are cooking? Uh, a game, if I can get it to show up. But it's not. Why not? Why not? Why won't you work? The, it broke it broke everything. Maybe they were right. It's gonna destroy my computer. Quack. <laughs> <laughs> 
Corrin jump scare. Maybe it's also one of those games that doesn't work with game capture. So many games do that. Yep. Here we go. Now why won't my... Oh, now VTube Studio also works. It broke everything. <laughs> there was a rescue expedition. Five people went missing in a local cave system. They came back without any without anything. Something is off about all that. Bodies just don't vanish into thin air. Oh! Should probably change the volume. It's frozen? Man, what the fuck? This game is cursed, I think. I can't capture it. Nope. Okay, different game. Oh, there it is! I got, I got it, I got it. Oh my god, is it the Nutty Putty Cave Simulator? Sometimes you'll need to move a little further to get out of a top out of tough areas. This time we're actually in a cave. This looks like ass. Oh, you think so? Come on, bro! It's because like half of his body gets like stuck or something. Turn around and click left on the map pocket. This? This. Oh my god. Green arrow is you. The yellow dots are objects to take a photo of. Okay. Are you playing on ladder? Come on, this got be sim. Yes, and what about it? I have found my favorite genre of video games. Oh. Okay, okay. Was this? This is a bag. Okay. Four left. Great, four photos left to take. Now explore further. You can only do one photo per cartridge, so remember to reload it every time you take it. Okay, where? Let me check the map. All right. Oh, doesn't say where. <laughs> Let's see what we can find. At least we don't have to remove these little bits and pieces. Oh. I mean, it's so... The body... <laughs> Makes it so awkward. Oh. oh! At least it won't run out of battery. 
we are unable to move our like move our limbs at an angle. So we have to crawl into the wall first so we can turn around. Those flashlights are still a very much a thing, right? Something attacks you. Flash it by doing... By... What? Something attacks me? Yellow dots will only appear if you're close enough to the object. So check your map. Ah. We're floating. I'm floating. Alright. Okay, I see. I guess it's an adrenaline kind of thing, right? But yeah, I would fucking never. Like, there, I, I would rather play video games like this. I'll just keep going down. Uh, excuse me. Bless you, thank you. Is it here? Oh, I'm just going the wrong way. I'm going right now? Sure. The dot's gone. It was like... Follow this path then. Oh, come on. And this way. Yep. The cause of exhaustion, well... Thought I heard something. Alright. Left. It's like... Left here now? Or is it because I'm turned around and facing that way? So I'm double checking. Oh shit. Whoa! On camera. Nice photo.
think it hit me because I got damage. That's why they had it as an old camera, right? Mr. Fish, hello, welcome. Okay, that one didn't really work out. Come on. Is there something left? There's text? Left? Is a person? Oh, three left. It's a number. <laughs> All right, um, let's uh, keep on crawling. Ah! Motherfucker. I'm gonna follow you, drag you the heck down. Shine this light in your face. Go. Can't move. Guess we'll go this way. <laughs> You're not the only one vacant. <laughs> I swear, no, it's a... It's a caving game. <laughs> I guess I'll go left at the next. Mm -hmm. Why can't I? Yeah, I need to go in here. Oh my god, it's so awkward. Okay, okay. All right, another body? Down. 
There he is! That's what a good colon sounds like. <laughs> I mean cave. This is a cave. Oh. Bitch, I can't see! Bitch, step out, out of it! Bitch, I can't fucking see! It's like that, <laughs> exactly. Ow! But at least in this game, you don't move at the at snail's pace, and there's actually enemies that can do something to you. I'm stuck. Oh, here we go. <clears throat> Colons are technically caves. I guess so. The sound effects are very satisfying with the opening. Just going back now? Yep. Can I turn around? No. Oh. Good timing. Okay, let's see if I can turn around. No. Like, just... Move your knees. Move backwards. Oh my god, no you can't. Why the fuck? <laughs> okay, replace the... How'd you even get turned around? I don't know. It's like after I took a... Took a look at the map or something. Like I just went straight. Can I turn around now? No, you just you just turn around on your back. Right? It's not that tight. Okay, wait, let me check the map now. Okay. And it's also like the arrow moves down right now, but it's like not the direction that I'm facing right now. It's the direction I'm crawling towards too. So now I have the feeling that I'm looking at south, but that's not it. Ugh. There he is! Well, this seems new. Am I stuck? Are we crawling? No, we are actually crawling through a cave. <laughs> the game is called Crawling, by the way. <laughs> Oh my god. Come on, towards the blood. That seems like something. Okay, yep. This game is about crawling in my skin. These wounds, they will not heal. I have to go left. Oh, motherfucker. I think there's like a three way split. Wait. 
Just straight up left. Okay. No, piss off! Okay, the camera. This? Beautiful photo. Um, I assume it's on the like the right side. Area. Oh my god. I have a feeling that the payoff is going to be very unsatisfying. Okay, go left. Come on, charge it! Brought a bottle of water. Come on. The problems of having a physical body. Crawling through someone's bottle. I swear. It's just a cave. Okay, straight ahead and then right. Well. Is this straight ahead then? There he is! Oh my god. Yep. I'm just guessing it's gonna be there. Cause I don't know. Right again? Don't turn around. Ah, fucking. Okay, I guess I'll go here. We cannot turn around anymore. Ah. I'm not sure if it's there, because... Uh, we're not getting anything on our map. Come on, crawl! Wanna go that way? Please let me go that way. You can turn around. There's so much space. <sighs> nope, I guess we can. I'm not allowed. <sighs> okay, never mind. We're going the right way. Oh, come on! I just took a picture! Alright. Let me out of here! I just want to go home to my family.
Oh. No one ventured into this cave ever again. Sometime after lone journalist disappearance, cave was finally the cave was finally sealed by the same company who started it all. May he. Missing people and the horrors that lurks beneath rest unbothered forever. Interesting. Yay, we beat it! I knew it! <laughs> Madness mode. No, thank you! My family, I just want to see my cat! The situation, yeah, you did nutty putty, right? We talked about it, <laughs> but that was kind of different. I, I highly doubt there were actually. Who knows? Maybe there were weird, weird looking zombies. It's like uh, the Descent. That's a pretty good horror movie. If anyone's looking for a horror movie to watch. Okay, boys, that's going to be it for today. I'm going to hope that my chicken has thawed enough. So I can uh, cook it. And I'm going to take Corin for a walk because he was... He kept bothering me to, during the stream for attention. So I'll give it to him. Thank you for stream. Thank you for watching. It was, uh, it was fun again. It's always fun playing through weird games together. <laughs> uh, I will be back tomorrow. I am going to play more Pacific Drive. So get your chill playlist ready. Okay. Or maybe I should uh, do the Drive playlist mod. But it'll it's copyrighted. I mean... It was a non-shitty version of Gar Garden of Bon Bon, so... If it's like that, I will play it. <laughs> mm. My shoulder be sore. Um... And you all here, model looks cool. Bon Bon, but you can even doesn't nuke your entire computer's memory exactly. <laughs> oh man. Okay, uh, raid, uh, raid, no, sup, hell yeah, bun bun, thank you guys so much for watching, have a great rest of your day, morning, night, evening, everything, and I hope you all had fun, I had fun, thank you so much for the follows, thank you so much for the subs, and... I will see you all uh, next time. Bye bye. Ow.